everybody, and welcome back to the Talus Principle 2 uh, Road to Elysium DLC. Probably the, the last Talos 2 stream, which feels so painful to say. I, I love this game. I adore this game so much. I don't want it to be the last stream of this game, but I have almost completed it now. <laughs> so I think it is going to be the last stream. I can't really like... Although I, I guess I could just like play through the whole game again. But I have so many other games I want to play, so I can't really do that. <laughs> but uh, welcome on in! Welcome, everybody! I'm Last time I got so close to completing it, but with a combination of um, drinking earlier in the day and extreme heat and tiredness and a headache, uh, the cards were not stacked in my favor, so I didn't quite manage to finish. And it was also really frustrating because I woke up the next morning and I was like, I know exactly how to solve this puzzle. I, I was so close. I was right there. <laughs> I was missing like a few tiny little points, but I know how to solve it. I'm pretty sure. It'll be so funny now if I run in there and I've, I've, I've gotten it completely wrong and I still don't have it. <laughs> but I think I know. But uh, let me say, let me welcome everybody before we start. Lumsev, congratulations on the first. And thank you for both the backseating command and also for recommending the game that I'm going to play after this. Because <laughs> I, I decided to look at it and like, even though it's a shorter game, I was like, I feel like a short game is probably what I want at the moment, especially because in the UK, things have still been very warm. The weather's still very warm here. It's, it's way better this weekend than it has been for a while. Like, I think yesterday was the first time in a very, very long time that my room got to below 25 degrees Celsius. <laughs> so it's it's still a bit warm, but it's definitely more bearable now. But I still figured it's probably best to, to look after myself a bit, to not like push myself too much. But yes, Maury, hello, lovely to see you. Just came off a workout. I hope you had a good workout. Honestly, I, I have Ring Fit Adventure. And I've not played it. I think I, I bought it. I was so motivated. I was like, I'm going to get fit and healthy now. I'm going to work out so much. I'm going to do this every day. I did it for two days. And then I skipped a day. And then I just didn't play it again. <laughs> so I need to get back on that, probably. I'm, I'm not a very physically fit person. I'm, I'm, I, I, I can carry things with my arms. I have very strong arms, but my legs are incredibly weak. So I, I really need to like be a bit more fit probably, to be honest. But yeah, that was something that uh, I, I, I had such, such positive, um, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know what the word I'm looking for is. I, expectations. I, the, the, I had such positive expectations for myself. And then I proceeded to not do it. <laughs> but it's okay. There's there's still time. There's always still time. So it's it's not a huge problem. But yeah, I, I do need to be more fit either way. But yes, and <laughs> Neko Leo, hello. Lovely to see you too. I deserve the head pats. Thank you. I appreciate the head pats very much. They are very appreciated. Also, more day drinking. Look, I, I'm not usually a day drinker, but it was it was a special situation. I went to visit uh, my dad and his new wife for the first time since they got married. And also like having a conversation with his wife for the first time uh, ever, like getting to know her. So like we were all just like sat together chatting, just having a couple glasses of wine, a um, couple pints of beer. Um, um, I, I may have been um, using it as a little bit of a crutch to be confident, but it's, it's okay, it was a one-off. But yeah, I, I didn't actually think while I was out, I didn't consider the fact that I was doing a puzzle stream right after. <laughs> it was like, it was later on in the afternoon and I was like halfway through my, my third beer and I suddenly thought to myself, hold on a second, I'm meant to be streaming Talos tonight. I probably shouldn't finish this beer. So I, I just like, I turned to Xander, I said, hey Xander, are you gonna be drinking more? And he was like, well, I wasn't gonna buy another one, but if anyone else is having another round, and I just silently handed him my glass and he had my last half pint of beer. 
a good moment. It's it's very nice. I I know he's always got my back. It's like if we're ever in a social situation somewhere, and like I don't want to like finish my drink, I know I can just hand it to him and he'll just be like, all right. <laughs> Oh, thank you for the hydrate as well. Yes. Let's have a hydrate. An, a non, non-alcoholic one. This is monster. But uh, sadly, I've run out of the fiesta now. So we've just got the white can today. <laughs> no fiesta. The, the abyss is too icy for that. <laughs> also, but wait, aspirations. That's exactly the word I was looking for. Thank you. That's the one, that's the one that my brain was not giving me. And Jack as well, hello! Welcome, welcome. Welcome back to uh, probably the finale of Talos 2, unless I magnificently fumble this and don't complete it in like four hours, which I'm really hoping is not the case. But yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to finish this though, because like, I, I was so close last time. I was really close last time. And like, if if I had been feeling well and the weather hadn't been as bad as it was, I'm pretty sure I would have been able to do it. Like, I would have just carried on with the stream. I would have just gone over time to make sure I did it. But I, I was in a spot where I was like, yeah, I, I can't do this. But it's okay, because I can today. I can. I have Monster. I've had a, a full, full roast dinner. Uh, what else? Uh, I've got three D20s on my desk in front of me. That's not actually related to anything. I don't know why they're there. But one of them is like on the 20 side, like the 20 is showing. So I'm I'm going to take that as a sign of success. Actually, I'm going to turn them all so they, they all say 20. There we go. <laughs> I'm rigging the dice in my favor. But it's okay. I can do that. They're my dice. Also, Dr. Anime, hello, welcome, welcome. Happy Sunday, everyone. But yeah, I hope everyone's been having a good weekend. Uh, mine has been mostly just taking advantage of the fact that I'm not melting to actually like do function a slight bit. <laughs> a little bit. Oh, thank you for pouring dice on my head. Oh, I guess I should like properly roll one. <laughs> I don't, I don't know when this started, but like every time someone does the, the dice on my head redeem, I feel like I have to roll a d20 now. It's just kind of become part of the redeem. Right, let's see what we got. That's a 16, I'll take that. A 16 is pretty decent, I will take that. I think that's a good sign. <laughs> oh, as a very sporadic monster drinker, you must say you very much prefer Ultra Rosa. I, yeah, Rosa is one of my favorites. I... I really struggle to pick a favorite flavor, but honestly, for the longest time, the Ultra Zero, just the white can, was my favorite. And then I tried different flavors, and I was like, actually, this th th this is the one that I... Th I it's okay. <laughs> it's all right, I suppose. If the others are available, I'll have those, but th this one's okay. But uh, the Ultra Zero is the only one which Xander can stand the smell of. Every time I have one of the other flavored monsters, he always complains that he can smell how sweet they are. Whereas this one is okay, smell-wise, apparently. <laughs> but it, I still really like it. I like it a lot because, like, it's, it's really interesting thinking about it. Like, I used to drink a lot of energy drinks, but the ones I drank were like the the mainline energy drinks, like the ones where you taste them and you're like, this tastes of energy drink. <laughs> but then as soon as I realized there were different flavored ones and different varieties, ever since tasting those ones, I can't drink regular energy drinks anymore. Like I, I just don't really like the taste. Like I will drink them if I have to, but I don't particularly like the taste of monster, like just regular black can green text monster. <laughs> Uh, ask how long take beat any game versus how long to make any meal. I'm sorry, I don't know what you mean by that. Uh, but um, if you're asking like with me, uh, it would take me much longer to make a meal than it would for me to complete a game because I can't cook. <laughs> I never have to. No, like if, th th if that's true. No, that th I guess that is true. I, I never have to like, <laughs> I know it's more like, yeah, I guess I don't have to 
drink them. It's like, if I need caffeine, I can get caffeine in other forms. I, I, There's no reason I would ever have to drink an energy drink. No, wait, I have one very hyper-specific example. <laughs> if I go to my Nan's house and she has bought me a can of regular Monster because she remembered I like Monster, then I will drink that whole can for her. I'll drink it for her because my Nan is <laughs> very, very old. And if she remembers something like that and she got it for me, then I will just happily drink that. <laughs> but no, you're right. I don't, there's no way that I like have to drink Monster. You're, you're so right there. Yeah, um, oh yeah, unless I got sponsored too. Hashtag not sponsored, hashtag monster. Please, please sponsor me. I had such a sad moment earlier because uh, one of my friends has just started streaming Death Stranding. And I was really excited, like I replied to them like, Monster Energy Time! And it turns out they're playing the, um, the director's cut version, which removes all of the monster branding <laughs> and replaces it with a generic energy drink. So I was just there like, no, but the monster. <laughs> monster where where are the mods i feel like somebody has to have made a mod to put the branding back in <laughs> well yeah anyway enough of our monster energy let's uh let's do some puzzling let's return back to the abyss and let's see i'm pretty certain i know how to do this last puzzle i'm pretty sure i know how to do this it was just very unfortunate last time, like the combination of heat and headache and alcohol, etc. But I'm pretty sure I know how to do this, because basically this is... It's the one called Halls of Power. Basically, I've got the two red-blue converters, the three red-blue converters here. They connect to these, but they also connect here. And I think what I have to do is... I'm not sure exactly which way to do it, so I'm gonna just like set up what I did last time and see how it goes. But the fact that these are red and blue, and the fact that there is a connector on the other side over here, I think what I'm gonna have to do is um, I'm gonna have to set it up using this connector as the thing that powers them and not the laser itself. Where is the connector? Oh, the connector's through here. Yeah, so I need to... I need to do it differently just to get through far enough to get the connector to begin with. I see. Also, yes, I do love lasers. Hi, Primal Zed. Welcome. Right, yeah, so I, I do it from this angle to begin with. And then I think what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to set it up in a way so that when these are all connected, they're going to be connected using the connector and not the laser. And then I'm going to just have to switch where that connector is connected to. Like, these three are all connected to each other. So if I just send the blue over to the middle one instead, it's going to flip all of them. And that will open these three then, once I've done that. But I need this for the setup first. So yeah, I think I start by just setting this up, like... All right, where can I set this up? So that I can see the laser and also the connectors. Here, here. Not quite. I'm gonna have to angle it. I don't care if things close, I have a ladder. Hmm. There's just so many, so many walls in the way. I guess I'll, I'll just stick it there for now. That's, that's just gonna close stuff. Let's, let me see if I can figure this out. Right, so now I, d 
don't actually want this connected to here. What I want to do is I want this connected to just this first one. Oh, I can't actually see it through there. I need to be able to connect it to this laser. Yeah, I can't see that from here, so I'm going to have to go back around and fix that. But I... So I think what I have to do here is I need to be able to, like, beam this blue to here. Like, bend it around. Or even, like, to the third one. If I can figure out a way I can connect this blue. Oh, yeah, to there? Oh, that blocks the beams like this, though. Mm. Right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go back out here. I'm going to set this all up without it going through to the the further ones. I'm just going to do it connected to the, the first gates. So then I can arrange things on the other side without having to worry about breaking the beams. So I can get a better, better idea of what's going on. Also, Lynn, hello! Welcome, welcome! Welcome to the final puzzle of... Uh, tell us to into the abyss dlc right because i think if i connect that to there oh then it'll also connect to that if i have it at this angle will it yeah because it's still connected to the laser at the moment it's not gonna it's it's like it's breaking here if i do this then i can literally connect that to there Oh no, I broke the... There. Okay, so that's connected to the third one now. Now I just need to connect the other two. In a way that's not gonna be... broken. That's the problem here. Never mind. Going back. I don't think this can be as far back as it is, because we need a way to activate these. See, my first thought was like, laser here connector here and here that would be great okay no that does connect no that should oh it does why <laughs> why was i so convinced that didn't work before why okay all right well it works so i connect that to there and there and there and so now none of them are actually connected to this laser they are connected to the connector <laughs> Don't you laugh at me. <laughs> no, I'm laughing at me too. I, I love how I was like, I can't believe this didn't work. I was so sure it would. It's because it would. It's because it would work. I was just being silly. And then so that goes there and there. So basically the idea now is this is set up so that I can get through. Fabulous. And now that I'm through, I just need to connect this to the second one instead of the first. So break the laser. Connect it to there, and there, and second one. Which should just work like that. Yeah, look at that, I did it! <laughs> it worked exactly how I imagined in my head. I love when that happens. <laughs> oh, I did it, yes! There we go. That's so funny. How was I positioning it so badly before that I thought that wouldn't work? <laughs> Well, puzzle 24. Oh. Oh. Welcome. <gasps> Welcome. Hi. Oh my goodness, hi. Who... Who are you? Me? Don't you recognize me? I mean, you. How is this possible? This place is a loop, Byron. Eventually, you loop back on yourself. So, here I am. And here you are. Oh, this is I weird. need answers. Oh, answers. Byron. Answers. It's always answers with you, Byron, isn't it? Because you have to know everything. Because you deserve yeah, to this know is Byron. everything. 
and everyone else just has to deal with it. It's not just about me, it's about all of us, all of New Jerusalem. Oh, really? Then why are you here solving puzzles instead of out there helping your friends? Is it because you want your mummy? <laughs> Is it because you're oh so sad because mummy left you and she didn't tell you why? It's not that simple, isn't it? What you can't get over is why she didn't tell you she was leaving. That has nothing to do with the city. It's just about your ego. Okay. You know what? Fine. Call it ego. After everything we went through, why not tell me? Why not take me along? Maybe she was just tired of you and your pathetic <laughs> clinginess. Wow. Oh, mummy, tell me what to do. Tell me what to think. Maybe she thought you'd finally grow up and actually do something instead of just complaining. I've done a lot more than just complain. It's not easy trying to push back against the momentum of history. Have you? I'm sure you annoyed Herman into letting you play Explorer and then you got your hand stuck on a magic <laughs> table and missed half the expedition. Great job. Meanwhile, New Jerusalem is falling apart. That's why we need Athena. Athena can't even save herself. You have a point. What? You may be some <laughs> sort of digital psychosis, but you're not entirely wrong. Uh -huh. I didn't live up to my principles. I let my personal insecurities oh. get in the way. I should have stepped up and taken responsibility. Responsibility? What makes you think you're cut out to lead? What makes you think anyone even respects you? Oh, shut up. <laughs> you're just trying to draw me back into the loop. It won't work. Yes. We're not done here. Yeah, we are. Thanks for the life lesson. Now, go away. I have things to do. Oh, Byron, yes. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh. What? I don't know. What's happening? Yes. 1K? Yes. Ah, oh, that little smile. <laughs> so that's why you were different. You literally confronted yourself. Must have been quite the experience. I wouldn't exactly recommend it as a leisure activity, but it was necessary. I was stuck in a loop as much as Athena was. We all were, I think, including myself. Uh. You know, you said something to me. I said, we don't need the theory of everything to be happy. And you said, it was never just about happiness. And I couldn't stop thinking about that. Because well, I knew I was right, that we could find happiness without expanding. But what if we needed more? Yes. What if a happy life and a good life aren't the same? And did you figure out an answer? No. And I'm still not sure what you're doing is right. But if I just sit around moping without actually participating... <laughs> then you're making the same mistake yeah. I did. <laughs> we swap positions. That's funny. I find it kind of embarrassing. <laughs> but look, the truth is, I don't really know what we should do. But I do know that we were always at our best when we were together. Mm -hmm. Amen so to that. True. It's good to have you back, Al. Oh, I love these two so much. Or we could just take off and dump all the responsibility <laughs> on 1K again. He did hold up well under pressure. <laughs> yeah. Oh, solve all puzzles in Into the Abyss. Revelation. Oh, I love that. I love that. I was not expecting the the twisted Byron self-doubt moment. But that, oh, that's so good. It, I feel like that's so important too as well. It's so easy to get stuck in a loop and also to just like give in to the intrusive thoughts. Like if, if you hear like thoughts in your head that are just like, well, what's the point in doing this? I'm kind of useless. Like, if you keep hearing those 
that self-doubt it's easy to like internalize that and give up because then you're just like well what's the point i'm useless but if you do listen to that then you will stop doing things and you will give up and you'll become useless so it's, it's like a self-fulfilling prophecy then you need to like break out of that ah that was good that's so good it's also something i have been so guilty of myself too like i'm i it's taken a long time for me to to learn how to ignore the little voices in my head that are the, like the 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 unhelpful ones <laughs> Ah, uh, so, uh, no puzzle two or three where I did the same idea from Halls of Power? Wait, I don't remember which one, but yeah, I'm pretty sure there was one of just, like, changing the... changing what it's connected to. Like that. Oh, well, since they locked out the last eight, you did 16 to one, then 24, so it was like two minutes. Oh, no, it was like... You went straight from that concept into that concept again. See, the way I did it, I had, like, the whole 20 puzzles in the middle to forget about that. <laughs> but, uh, I've got to say, though, even though last week I was really out of it towards the end of it, I'm still really proud that I did notice the fact of, like, the, the connectors being opposite colours and having the moment of, like, I'm pretty sure I can do that and switch the colours afterwards. I'd already, like, gotten to that part of the solution in the stream even if i didn't manage to actually this was the story of Ooh. the people we were a long time ago Ooh. when humanity was young i remember it all the places the names our flaws our fears our clunky old bodies i used to have regrets but when i look back now I feel nothing but love. Yes. The world has changed, Aww. and we have changed with it. But the bonds that were forged in those years so long ago on that distant blue planet, those bonds were never broken. Distant? We are still here, and we are still human. Hello? Hello? <laughs> okay. Okay, so we're ending like that. Oh my goodness. Oh, amazing. Oh, I'm... Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm left in a spot where I'm like, I feel like that ended wonderfully and also still leaves me wanting more. Like, I'm... <laughs> like... I, I want more just because I love the Talos principle so much, but also like that. That was good. That was good. Anyway, uh, I'm not just ending Talos 2 there because there are a few things that I did want to try before I move on to my next game. One of those is I want to go back to Orpheus Ascending and not cheese that one puzzle. <laughs> The gold one at the end. Now that I actually know how the laser blocking works a lot more, I want to go and actually solve that properly. And also in Isle of the Blessed, uh, the green one, green five, five? Was it five? Was it green five? I think it was green five, the one that I didn't quite solve properly too. I want to go back and try that too. Yeah, will it let me just jump back in? Yes, it will. Nice. Right, so it's this one. Yeah, I fully cheesed this one. <laughs> but now I know how the laser blocking works, so I could just go boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. I'm pretty sure something like that'll work. So let's check, test it. Is that what I wanted to do? No, it's, hold on. Other sides. Like that and that. Yeah, there we go. Then the red's active for a bit. Now the blue's active for a bit. Okay, now that's that's reconnecting too soon, I think. We'd have it slightly more there, but I think that should do it. And I think that's like the the intended solution now. 
enemy through. Oh, no, it, it's, it's not gonna... Sh the, the gates just stay open because of me already solving it, but... But... Yeah, that's long enough to open that gate. And now it will switch. And... Yeah, and that's long enough to open that gate. Yeah, that, that's, that's all I wanted. It was more for my, <laughs> my own personal, like, self-satisfaction to know that I... I know how to set it up. But yeah, that's so clever, though. I, I do find it so funny that I managed to find, like, a single tiny angle that made it work. <laughs> But yeah. Oh wait, that's so that's so true. I can reset them, can't I? This is the reset, isn't it? Yeah, restart puzzle. Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> I forgot I could do that because I've just not done that at all. <laughs> boop boop. A boop. Boop boop. A boop. There we go. And this should work. Just gotta wait for it to go back there. There we go. Yep, red's connected for long enough. And now we'll break the red and the blue will connect. Yeah. Perfect. There we go. That's so much neater than the way I like squish them into the corners. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Okay. Back to main menu. And then Isle of the Blessed. Here. <laughs> uh, most surprised that it passed QA. Well, I've, I did work very hard <laughs> to, to squeeze it in that spot. <laughs> oh, I, I've, I've got to, I always wonder, like, how difficult it would be to QA games like this. Like, I can imagine, like, coming up with an amazing puzzle with such a beautiful solution and then giving it to people to playtest and they're just like, hey, I broke it. <laughs> There's got to be so many ways that you can break them in completely unexpected ways. Like the little moments of just, why would anyone try and do that? The answer is because they they could. That's usually the reason for anything. Right, what? Which one was it? Okay, that's eight. Uh, I'm... I'm already lost. Eight. Where am I? The map is literally right here. How am I getting lost? Eight. Five. Oh, so this is five? I think this is five. Oh, it's up? Hold on. Oh, it's around the other side. Here it is. This one. Which one is this? Did I choose this one? Oh yeah, I did because I just like ran through at the end. <laughs> I remember now. Right, let's reset this and give it a try properly. <laughs> I remember now. Yeah, I literally just like timed it so there was like a second I could lock myself in at the end. I remember now. Let's try and solve it properly. Oh, do I want info about minor collectibles? Yeah, I think now's the time as well where we can drop the uh, the no pointing things out thing. If there are things that I missed that you want to point out, you are welcome to now. Now is the time. Still no uh, backseating for the puzzle as I try and solve it uh, properly. But yeah, if there's any like little easter eggs and stuff, I'm always happy to hear about them. Oh yeah, because I didn't even like use this fan and stuff. Hmm. Right, yeah, I need to go in there first. Bye. Let me grab that. Oh, I think the Talos devs aren't bothered by puzzles being breakable in general. As long as the intended solution is more obvious or at least more obviously correct than the cheese, they don't seem to mind the cheese existing. 
I see. Yeah, that makes sense, I think. It's like, I know they've patched some things where it's been, like, properly breaking. Like, you can put a thing where it shouldn't be. And it, like, kind of ruins the puzzle. Like, those kind of solutions they patch out. But I think when it's, like, little things that still feel like they would be a, a decent solution... I don't- I don't think they mind things like that. Right. So... There is cube in there. Oh, jammer! I can jam the fan! Let's jam that fan so I can get through. I can detach it. Yes, let me take that. And then... Ah, yes. Let's use the fan. So we've got a cube. Haha. -ha. So now I don't have to jam that anymore, so I can use this to... Oh, hold on. Oh, I guess to jam that so I don't have to have this on the button. Because I'm going to need this in order to connect here. Oh, but there's that. Oh, no! I know how I can do this. Maybe. I'll do that and that. So then that's open. So then, now that it's open, I can actually jam that. And the laser goes through. To there. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Don't actually need this, do I? I can I can borrow that. Borrow this. Yeah, borrow this, do that. Like that? Oh no, because of that being connected. Oh, I didn't think about that. Hmm. Yeah, that's what I- I, I just body blocked it before, didn't I? There's, there's gotta be a solution where I don't just body block it. Hold on. Oh! Like that? There we go! There we go! And now this is higher up, so it's not blocking the other lasers. There we go. That's the intended solution. Um, this is... It may be connected to one extra thing that it doesn't need to be, but yeah, there we go. That's how that one's solved. I see. <laughs> Yeah, that's a much neater way of solving it. Nice! Puzzle solved! Big brain time! Yes! Hello, Vino! Welcome! Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the tail end of big brain time for this game. Wait, I just realized, is that... Oh my goodness, that puzzle is like underneath this one. I never realized that. I never noticed that. How did I never notice that before? that they're literally on top of each other. Did I just not look up? It's that video gamer thing of like, gamers never look up, isn't it? <laughs> I never looked up, did I? I did not look up once. Oh my goodness, yeah, I had no idea. That's so funny. I can't believe I didn't notice that. Ah, <laughs> oh, but uh, da 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 da. Uh, there's a didn't complete all puzzles version of Into the Abyss ending now, but naturally it's a bit awkward to get now. Well, I can I can just speed run and go through stuff. I can speed run like eight puzzles that aren't super difficult because I've done them now and I'm pretty sure I remember the the solutions. So I, I can do that quite easily, I think, because some of them 
I found considerably easier than other puzzles. <laughs> Uh, just load the save. No, I can't load the save now because I've solved all 24. Oh, unless... I wonder if it'd work if I go to a puzzle and, like, reset it. As though I haven't completed it. I don't know if that would work or not. Maybe I could try it. Let's try it. Oh, wait, did I want to look for the sparks? I don't know if I... <laughs> I don't know if I care enough for the sparks, honestly. <laughs> Does anyone know where they are? Would anyone be able to tell me? Because, like, I feel like the Prometheus flames uh, are the thing I care about the least, but a little part of me now is also like, but... but completion? <laughs> oh, that's a laser. Oh, actually, you know what we can do? You know what we can do very quickly before I leave here? Something very important. Whereabouts is it? Hold on, I, I need to... I've forgotten where I am. Where's the big rock yes! part? Oh my god! <laughs> Uh, blue four, yeah. I'll, I'll, I I want to try blue four. Yeah, I think I think I did do like an unintended solution to that too. But uh, before I leave the green area, there's something I wanted to find, but I've I've I forgot the, what the layout of anything is. So I'm just gonna come back to uh, here. Where is it? Where is the bit I'm thinking of? Oh, it's like here? Oh, it's near the the lost puzzle. It's near the lost puzzle. Wait, is that an unpicked up thing? No, they stick around on this one. Something I realized when I interacted with one and it was like, oh, if I hadn't already gotten it, I it would have just automatically played instead of me having to interact. Here, yeah, this is the area. One, one other thing we can do in this area, too, before we head off, just because... I like it. Where was it? It was, like, around here somewhere. Was it back? Oh, here, here. Here, here? Around here? might not still be here. I'll be really sad if I can't do it again. I don't think I can do it again. No, I can. Yes. Yes. Okay. 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 Important. Important thing achieved. Received. I got the important thing. Right. Now let's go back to blue four. Oh, for the flames, one's below a puzzle in the blue section. One's somewhere on the beach acting as a fire on the fireplace. Oh, wait. That's cute. Have I gotten one like that? Uh, one in the green section to the right of like two or five. Yeah, I got the, I think I, did I? Oh no, I don't think I got a flame from that section. I got the sprite. Cause I remember the sprite really surprising me because I just, it just took me on a really gentle walk along the path and then it was done. And I was like, I, I fully expected to be walking on ceilings and stuff. <laughs> right. Here we go. I, th I think I might have gotten the campfire flame. I do remember getting a couple of them. I think I remember getting the one underneath the puzzle in the blue section too. So it's probably the green one that I'm missing? Maybe. Or one of them. Yeah, because I've got four. So if there's like two in each area, that means there's two I'm missing. Oh, thank you! Thank you for sending me a list. Let me check. Bum, 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 bum. Da, 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 da. Oh, 
Okay, I, I don't think I've gotten a beachside one. Uh, in the green area. Right side of green two. Where is green two? Okay, this is green two. Did I get, I think I got one up here. No, I didn't. I didn't get this one. Okay, there we go. Five out of six. <laughs> one more left. One more left. I have no idea which one it is. But uh, I can just check them all, I guess. Uh, I think... I think I got the other one in the green section. Right, because it says the other one is between, like, the the green lost puzzle and the green tower. Like, in the water. Kind of. And I'm, I think I may have gotten one from in the water. I feel like I remember getting one in the general vicinity around here. We'll see. Let's see. I feel like blue was the area I did the least exploring in. So that's probably the one I'm missing. Because I did loads of exploring around here when I was trying to solve the, the Sphinx puzzle. Wait, that's going to be exactly why I didn't do as much exploring in blue, isn't it? Because the Sphinxes were in green and red. <laughs> so that's why I was wandering around them so much. Also, yay, your horoscope is everything is friends. I have 12. <laughs> friends are good. Friends are good to have. Right, let's head to here. Right, let's have a wander. I don't think I had much of a wander in the blue area. So let's take it in. Oh yeah, wait, there was a thing at the end there. I remember that much. I remember getting lost underneath the puzzle over there, so that flame I know I've gotten. But I don't think I got another flame in this area. Maybe? Maybe I did? Wait, it was there? Wait. Where? Here? Like, I keep thinking I see the flames, but it's just like a patch of flowers. But... <laughs> In the water, go towards the red area. Is it? Because there's like, there's the memory which I've already listened to. What's this? Because this is going into the red area now. Ah, oh, no. Uh, did, did you see the memory? <laughs> Those are pretty cool rocks, though. Gotta say. Gotta say. I turned around. I thought this was like a little, like, sand cave that somebody had made. It's just a cool rock. But it is a very cool rock. But no, that's that's completely fine. They... <laughs> there have been so many times I feel like I've, I've looked out and I've been like, oh, there's something really cool here. And then I get closer and it is a rock. <laughs> An interestingly patterned rock. Which I still consider a victory, honestly, because I think rocks are cool. <laughs> but not quite what I'm looking for. Another memory. Oh, could there be anything here? Just a bit of debris. Nothing around here. I love this. I love I love being like prepared for big brain puzzle times and then being like, actually we're going on a scavenger hunt. <laughs> it's so fun though. Honestly, this whole area is so nice to look at too. Yeah, there's the underneath. I I know there was one under one of the puzzles. I, I did get that one. Mm-hmm. All right, I haven't looked at the screenshots yet. I may have to actually do that in a second. 
Well, we can wander first. Honestly, I feel like a lot of my life has been really hectic and fast-paced and stressful at the moment, so I kind of just like having a little wander around on the beach, to be honest. <laughs> a little moment to just relax and calm down. Oh, this, this umbrella's not up. Is that also just a rock? Yep. That's the lost puzzle. Maybe I should pick up. Let's let's go through the trees. See, I th the fact that there's an island like right back there. I really wish I could reach that because I want to. I want to just walk over to that island, but I'm pretty sure, like, yeah. If I go any further than this, I'm just gonna perish. Right, hold on, actually, let's... You know what? Let's have a look. Let's go have a look at this island. I may not be able to reach it on foot, but we can have a, a nice little look at it. Look at that. It's lovely. <laughs> Yay. Gotta say, one thing I find very funny is that um, when you're in camera mode, if you're like dragging the camera like this, it doesn't lock your cursor to the window. So if I keep dragging it this way, I end up like with my cursor on my first mon on my on my like my left hand monitor <laughs> instead of <laughs> instead of like the game window. And then like I try and click, and I'm just clicking onto like a program in my other monitor, and I'm just like, hold on. Right, anyway. Uh, right, let me, let me have a look. And naturally, there are also more Easter eggs to find. Yeah, I definitely haven't found all the Easter eggs, I'm pretty sure. But, um, let's... Have a quick look. Okay, yeah, I definitely got the one that's underneath puzzle three. And then the other one, yeah, it says it's like around the back of the lost puzzle next to a, next to like a, a deck chair and an umbrella. So I, if I haven't spotted it, I'm pretty sure I probably did get that one. Yeah, not here, but here be here yeah it would be here so i got this one okay <laughs> okay so i've got them in blue i've got them in green it's going to be one in the red area then so before i head out of here let's go to blue four see if i remember how i solved that and figure out how it should actually be solved okay, how do i get up <laughs> I'm stuck. Help. Help. Okay. I'm up. I'm up. Oh, I'm less down. There we go. I made, <laughs> I made it. I made my way back. Yeah, either, either red or the green one that's just out in the water somewhere. I'll, I'll check the red area first. And then we can go back to green if it's, if it's not there. Also, ArtMV, hello, welcome, welcome. Welcome to me finishing off uh, Talos 2 DLC. And by that, I mean, um, I'm gonna try and solve a puzzle that I, I think I cheesed the first time around. Right, okay, yeah, I, I'm pretty sure I did cheese this, this one because I didn't use half the things in the level. Right, let's restart it. Let's try solve this. I don't remember how I solved this one. But it didn't feel like I used everything in the level, I don't think. I don't know, let's try things out. I angled it. Yeah, that's... <laughs> yeah, I feel like all of the levels that I've managed to cheese somehow has been me 
misbehaving with angles. <laughs> just lining things up at like the perfect spot where it can only just about reach in the perfect way. All right. Oop. Connect that to right here. I've now got a blue one. Right. If I connect this, like... I wonder if there's a spot I can connect this where it will hit the, the fence outside as well. I think it's just slightly out of range, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that's probably intentional. Yeah, it'd have to be, like, here. And it can't see the laser through that. Oh, hold on. Oh, actually... Connect it to that laser. I go boom. I don't need this connector anymore now. I can use this to angle the blue. To be at a point where the blue can keep that door open. Okay, door's open now. I've got the connector. Hmm. Never mind, I did not think this through. Oh no, no, I think this will work, but I need to get the blue thing out of here. So let's set that back up. But I've got that set up now so that I can reach the blue laser and I can reach the red laser. So maybe. So now I bring this back. I've already set up the connector in there because we need two here. So I'm, I'm going to try, like, hold on, try like that first, and then, oh no, because it's like round a corner, I think I will need the connector. Oh, hold on. Oh, I need to set up the blue connector around here. I know how to do this. I know how to actually solve this now. <laughs> I may be in trouble. I may have, like... Because I've left the connector in there, I may have, like, trapped myself. I don't think I can open that again. I think I may have to reset. But I think there's going to be a way where I'll be able to position the blue. Where I can possibly see it. Oh, I don't know, though. The angle is so awkward. That angle would be incredibly awkward, because I can't actually see it from there. Huh. Hmm. Hold on. actually have to open this one if I can get the laser around here. Yeah, I just need the red pointing around here. Oh, I'm so... that's... it's very straightforward. Never mind. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I know what I have to do here. I see why it's called the big hassle. It's okay. I didn't actually have to do that either, I don't think. So I'll do that to there. And then bring this to here and here to open door. No, oh, like, do I even need this? I feel like, hold on. I want to try something because I'm pretty sure if I just do... Oh no, it's... It wouldn't, never mind. 
I was like, I could, I could just like have the connector here. But no, that's that's not what I was thinking. Never mind. My my whole idea here was imagining an additional connector in the middle here. I don't know why. Because I was like, well, I can just connect the laser in here, and then I can connect it from there. But then that's going to be so far away from where the actual end is. Huh. <sighs> I feel like the idea probably is to use the blue somehow. But I don't know where I'd be able to angle things so that it would work. Hold on. Let me try things. Lasers are fun! It's true! I love them! Uh, this was the first puzzle in Isle that stumped you. Yeah, I, th I think, like, now that I'm, like, in here trying to actually solve it properly... It's kind of stumping me, too. <laughs> hmm. It's like I could do something like that, but it's like nothing's gonna reach the angle I need it to. Yeah, because one of my first thoughts was going around here. So I wasn't sure about that. Also, hello! Yamato! Welcome Do I on get in. an achievement now? Hello, welcome! Thank you for the raid! Oh my goodness! 36 months! Oh my goodness, that's the three-year mark! Uh, you, you get the, the badge upgrade. <laughs> you get a sub-badge upgrade! Oh my goodness, thank you so much! Thank you so much for three years. That's incredible. And welcome on in, Raiders. I hope you're doing well. Welcome, welcome. I hope you had a good time with the, the Final Fantasy XIV. Where, whereabouts are you in fourteen? Are you doing, like, uh, like up-to-date content or earlier content? Because uh, I've only played up to halfway through Endwalker, so... Oh, Shadowbringers! I have played that then. <laughs> Oh, Shadowbringers is my favorite. I love that expansion so much. I hope you've been having fun with it. <laughs> but thank you so much for bringing the raid this way. To anyone who's new here, hello. I'm Liri. I'm a pink haired cat girl from the UK, and I love comfy games and puzzle games. And I'm currently puzzling in uh, the Talos Principle 2 DLC, which is the DLC to a game that I, I love very dearly. And the DLC has been just as good. <laughs> And uh, I've, I've actually technically finished the DLC now, but the first time I solved this puzzle, I did not solve it with the intended solution. I, I know for a fact that whatever I did was not the intended solution. <laughs> but uh, I'm, I'm trying to figure out how to solve it properly now so that I can feel satisfied with myself. Because if I just leave it, I will... I haven't fully solved them all then. So I... I'm kind of cheating. I don't want to cheat. I want to solve it all. <laughs> but uh, close to the end of the main quest line, then you got the post-game quest before Endwalker. Oh, oh, I hope you've been having fun with it then. Oh, that, that expansion is so good. And honestly, all of the post, like post uh, main story quest, like patch missions con quests, as, oh, what am I talking about? <laughs> the stuff after the main, like, leveling content is also really really good like the whole story in Shadowbringers is just really really well done <laughs> so I, I hope you've been enjoying it and uh, thank you very much for the raid too I, I really appreciate it and uh, I know it's super late for you too it's, it's like 11pm so if you have to head off that is completely fine but if you don't want to head off I'm still here. Right, I'm thinking the reason why this one is like... What's it called again? A major hassle? Yeah, the big hassle. I think it's going to be to do with bringing the red laser around in a silly way. But I feel like that would be like using the connector. There's only one connector here. This one is... Like, why is there this little passage here? I can see into there through this. Which makes me think 
I'm gonna need a connector like here. But I can't see any lasers from here. Hmm. Mysterious. Very mysterious. It's great, but we don't talk about the ARR post game. <laughs> They've actually really streamlined the quests now. The first time I played 14 was it was a very, very long time ago. Um for like for a bit of context, um I went to the Final Fantasy Fan Fest in London in 2014. <laughs> if anyone wants to know when I started playing 14. <laughs> It's been a little while, but um, I'm, I'm still not up to date with the, the story, though. I've just been really busy recently, and it's pain. <laughs> pain and suffering. But uh, recently, they've actually streamlined the quests, so there aren't as many quests after A Realm Reborn anymore. And a part of me is really glad they did that. Another part of me is, like, a little bit sad. Like, it feels like a bit of a shame, because it's like, well, I, I had to fight through uh, starting a party for Titan or whatever, then <laughs> nobody has to do that anymore. It's like, back in my day, we did so much awful, oh, so many awful fetch quests. But yeah, a lot of it, I think, I think it's something that's definitely gotten better with Final Fantasy. I've, I've, I shut the connector in there again, so I think I need to reset to figure out where to position it. But they've definitely improved that. Also, Val, hello! I am thinking. I'm thinking and talking about Final Fantasy XIV. <laughs> but oh, welcome, welcome! But yeah, it's it's a, such a strange situation because some people hate, like, the silly quests. And then people like me, I adore the silly quests. I like silly quests a lot. But it, like, depends on where they are and how they're done sometimes it just feels like a bit too much right so now that's connected with the connector i can bring it through and i'm thinking now like i need this to be like here maybe as close to the the edge as it possibly can be for me to see it from like the angle I'm thinking of let me let me try an experiment like it's not gonna work now because the barrier's still up but if I had it like at that very far angle no not that one it'd have to be here to open the door. No, that's gonna... Yeah, that's cutting through the wall. That doesn't work. But yeah, it's something they definitely got better with as they made more expansions. <laughs> like, uh... As time went on, they, they definitely improved the side quests and made them a little more relevant to the story. Because th 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 there's... Th it's, it's a lot of fun, but then sometimes... This stuff that feels like it should have been a side quest and it was part of the main story scenario. <laughs> oh, you're really sad about it. They removed one of the quests involving Horshafar that was really silly. Oh, wait, I need to look that up afterwards. I need to actually see which ones they removed because there's some quests that... I remember people being like, oh, I'm so glad they cut these out from the main story now. But I, I really liked them. <laughs> oh, 2014 was the last time you played an MMO. Oh... Which MMO would that be? Like, honestly, I feel like the only MMO I've ever gotten into was Final Fantasy XIV. I've never been able to get into MMOs, usually. But I think... I think for me, like, what it was... God, I'm still not even sure what I'm doing here. Uh, for me, what it was was I, I started playing Final Fantasy XIV on PlayStation on the PlayStation 3. <laughs> so it always felt different from that point because I always played it with controller. I still play it with controller. I play on PC, but I've gotten so used to the controller crossbar that I have to have the, the crossbar. 
to make it work. See, it's like, if I did something like this... Then it'd be like, I'd be able to, like, come around here and connect it like that. But I can't do that when the gate is still shut. So I'm guessing that's what I need the blue one for. But then how do I connect it to that laser? Because that laser is so far back. <gasps> Wait. Wait. Wait, I think I just answered my own question. Maybe. No, I don't think I did. Never mind. Uh. So right. What a hassle. Oh, no. Unless... No. Hmm. See, if I could connect that to the red somehow, that would be so good. But I don't think I can. Oh, it's been months and you're still not over a certain character death. Oh, those moments. Those moments are always so... I've got to say, I love watching people go through um, main story stuff in 14 for the first time, like being unspoiled. And just like watching and waiting for like specific moments in the story. Because... There's, there's quite a few I can think of where it's always so interesting seeing people's reactions. Ugh. Really don't know how I'm... How I'm gonna do this. it's the fact that like the red laser is where it is and there's like walls in the way I'm gonna shut the connector in there again I just want to have a look and see what happens then be like right huddled up here almost can the red reach it's like it'd have to be here to reach the door and it feels yeah the, the wall is just in the way there so how I don't know how to do this. Hmm. Yeah, it's just hitting the wall slightly. I'm pretty sure there's not a spot I can get the laser and the door. Yeah, look, th no, there's, there's one spot. <laughs> I don't know if that's right. I really don't know if that's meant to be right. That feels like it's so close. It doesn't feel like it's right, but I don't know how to solve this one. <laughs> yeah, that, that's, that's the solution I did before. That's how I did it before. <gasps> Thank you for the hydrate. Yeah, maybe that's what I need. I need, I need the monster energy. It is I, the queen of um, cheesing laser puzzles with angles. I just know how to angle those lasers perfectly. <laughs> oh, mini hint. You know what? I think I would accept a mini hint at this point, so long as it is just like a very tiny nudge. Because <laughs> it's figuring out how to incorporate the blue in this that's really baffling me. It's like, I feel like... Like, the fact that there's this little passageway here me makes me think, like, going like this would make sense. And I'm not sure what I'm doing. 
Oh, oh was, was that not a mini hint? Thank you, mods. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't want to be told how to do a puzzle. But I, I like more like little things like, yeah, like th think outside the box is a good hint. Because it's making me think like I'm, I'm really focused on like this one set at the moment, like everything I'm trying at the moment. I keep trying the same things, but the fact that there is a passageway here, it makes me, makes me think that it's like having like the connector here maybe. But it's like, why? But why? Hmm. I don't really use the activate as much. I don't. <laughs> uh... Trying to remember things. Uh, may may you tray with a mini hint? Uh, a tray? What kind of tray? Hold on. I think I've just remembered something. I think I just remembered something. Pretty sure I just remembered something. Do these activate by like being inside each other too? They do. Oh my goodness. I forgot that. I forgot that. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That's. It's been so long since I did a puzzle that required that. It's. I forgot they activate themselves. I've done puzzles like that where they activate themselves. That's what I have to do here. <laughs> And then I'll just position this. So that'll keep that open now. Wait, I can I can make a, a further ring than that too. I'm just gonna put this like on the very edge where it will connect that. Like that. Okay, that's keeping it open. Right. There. Open it up, activate that. It's gonna be in range if I put it here, right? Yeah, the, oh, there it is. There it is, okay. Oh my goodness. See, that is one where if I had been playing it like as I was playing the base game and doing the puzzles where you had to like overlap them with each other, I would have gotten it a lot faster, but I, I just straight up forgot that rule, honestly. Oh, for reference, the attempted mini hint was you don't always need a laser. Oh wait, no, yeah, that would have that would have given it away. <laughs> I'm glad that was deleted. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. But yeah, I'm I'm very good at forgetting things that I can do with things. I'd I'd forgotten about that. Funnily enough, I'd forgotten about that rule until I said to myself out loud, it's been a while since I had to use an activator. I forget all the details, and as I said that, I, I suddenly had the, the thought of like, hold on. <laughs> it's like, it's the, the programming, the rubber duck approach. Like, if you're ever stuck on something, just start saying things out loud to yourself, and it'll help you figure things out. Oh, I'm glad I solved that properly now. I feel accomplished. Uh, check under puzzle three. No, I've gotten that one. That was that was one of the first ones I I got. I know I have this one. I already went through the maze under here. I had a had a great time with it. Fun maze times. <laughs> so I think it's gonna be in the red area. But the red area is also where our secrets are going to be as well. So yeah. All right, gonna head out. Oh, I hope you have a, a lovely rest of your night, Yamato. Thank you for the raid again. Thank you for sticking around for a bit too, even though you've just been streaming yourself as well. <laughs> oh, I, I can't believe I forgot that. I. It's so easy to forget things when it's like a mechanic I haven't used in a while. <laughs> I feel like it happened with something else too. I don't remember exactly what now, but I I do remember there was one puzzle where I forgot something I could do with something. And it made it harder. Right, anyway, we need to find our treasure. 
before we do anything else? Oh, which I think is up this way, yes. Right, where is the treasure cave? Yeah, here it is, yes! Okay. We got the key. Do I not have the key because I reset the puzzle? I think I might not have the key because I reset the puzzle. Okay, we're going back to get the key. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, I know where it is now. Huh. Righto, not a problem. It's okay. At least I know it will be there. <laughs> and there's a rock. There's the key rock. It's like here? Here, there we go. Okay, key. Key reobtained. <laughs> now we get the treasure. At least I remembered where the treasure cave was as well, because last time I fully forgot where that was. I was hugging the wall around that whole cave. And I could not find it. Oh yeah, I could check for the flame here too. Yeah, hold on. Actually, let me just... I think it should show up in photo mode. Uh, although it might not if my render distance isn't high enough, I guess. I know, let's, let's, we can just go have a look. <laughs> like, I feel like it'd be like this spot. Yeah, I, th I think this is the spot where it would be. I'm pretty sure I got it. I think. Yeah, it's not this one. It is all in the red area. Well, there's, well, there's, it's literally one of them. There's one in the red area. <laughs> Process of elimination. It's so funny because I have to turn the render distance down here because of streaming and also all of the leaves and rocks. But it's so funny seeing things just like spring into existence in front of me. Especially, like, the, the flowers, when suddenly a patch of flowers just, like, appear. Like, oh, like, oh there's nothing there. Oh, flowers! <laughs> oh, yeah, that's the map. That would, uh, would be fun and completely illogical to have a flame underwater. <laughs> I mean, like, on top of the water would make sense. Underwater would kind of suck, because... Pretty sure Yakut doesn't have a waterproof body yet. Which is why Miranda went swimming on her own. <laughs> anyway, now I have the key. We got the tape. We got the tape. But I'm not going to play the tape until we find the last sprite. The last sprite, it's a spark. It's, it's the Prometheus spark, they're not sprites. Right, where would it be? Oop, probably not off the cliff. Right, I'm gonna stand here and um, think very hard. Definitely not look it up. Also Thermopile, hello, welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome to me finishing the, the DLC for Talos 2. I'm so close. Okay, where is this? Um, on the trail in the middle, okay. Have a look there. I don't think I've I gotten think. one here. So I think 
where I need to go, maybe. I cannot think. No, but I actually am thinking at the moment. <laughs> Which one is this? This is four. All right, so then continuing up here, this is where five and six are. Apparently there's... There's gonna be like another little path somewhere. Like up here, oh that, yeah, that's where Byron and Al are having a, having a good time. Reconnecting. Be around here? Over this side? Let's just have a wonder. See, the thing is, it gives a screenshot, and I, I don't have any idea where the screenshot is. <laughs> There's a bridge fragment in the screenshot. Oh, wait, yeah, I see it. Oh. Oh, I see that. Okay. Yeah, so it'd be like... Yeah, I think it was exactly where I was before, like here. So I think I got this one. <laughs> so that means it's gonna be down on the beach. I think, like towards the, the mega structure. Like apparently there's something along here, like a, a boat a hole that it's in. I'll find it eventually. Oh, think next to the, the triangle puzzle, not here. Oh, that, that would make sense. That would make sense. Anyway, uh, Master of Navigation, as I'm sure you all are very aware of at this time. Right, I'm just gonna like follow the, the beach around. <laughs> Around this way. Around here. Hmm. No, see, because the... It's like facing towards the red tower. Hold on. Like back here? Yeah, I think it's like. Yeah, it'd be like back here. Oh, it's like right out of the way. No wonder I didn't find this one. It's so far back here. Yeah, I never went up here. This is a really nice little alcove, though. I like this spot. It's just tucked away. Tucked away in the back. There we go. Completion. Feels good. Feels good. <laughs> Let's celebrate. <laughs> it's celebration time now. <laughs> oh, that was a, a really nice way to, to finish off the DLC, though. Here we go. Here we go. Did it. Celebration. <laughs> We did it! I'm having a celebratory drink. <laughs> oh, look at him go! Hold on a second. 
thank you for the hydrate. Yes. There we go. Ha ha. <laughs> yes. I did it. I love their little shades. I love their little shades so much. They're so good. <laughs> this is the best way to celebrate. I love that I was just like, I, I finished into the abyss. And I, um, I'm now here. This is how we're celebrating. It was a good way to celebrate. Right, now with that, it's time for me to pop back into the abyss and uh, do the, the other exit, I guess. So yay. Yay. <laughs> I love that that emote is just, it's just become the emote for like the end of a good time. When a good time stops, it's just. <laughs> it's my impression of, I can't, I can't really frown very well. Not until I'm re-rigged. But uh, yeah, let's pop back into the abyss. And let's see. Oh, I think it did. It saved me like, did it save me like? After completing it, I'm gonna use this and just like reset the puzzle. Oh. No, because it's still showing them all in the top. But I'm wondering if it will be different if I specifically go in here and interact in here. If this will be a different exit to me hitting the other stuff. Oh, it keeps it solved on a meta level. Yeah, but yes, I got all of the achievements. I did. I, I double checked. I, the only achievement I had left was solving all of the puzzles in Into the Abyss. And I, I saw that one pop. So I have completed the achievements for this game, which feels really good. You know what? I'm, I'm going to just speed run. I'm gonna just start a new game, speed run through eight of the puzzles, and slam my hand on the thing immediately. That's that's the plan now. <laughs> the mind is its own place, and in itself can make a heaven of hell a hell of heaven. Hee <laughs> hee. Yeah, I think it should show the other ending, also I can load previous save. Yeah, I know there's like the backup things. But, like, ever since I suggested it, a part of me now just wants to, um, speedrun eight You've been puzzles. making a lot of progress. I can... Yeah, I can skip. Sorry, I already saw that. Buzz. But yeah, like, ever ever since I mentioned, like, what if I just speedrun through eight of them what and the... get the exit that way? I, I just kind of want to do that for Byron. the sake of it now. Byron, can you hear me? No. Oh, this can't be good. Sorry, I can't Have hear I been you damaged? Puzzles. Am I in sleep mode? Oh, you this are. But this is not your dream, Byron. Oh, I cheese this one. It Let's not Athena's. do that one. <laughs> your mind is trapped in the gyre of her thoughts. Oh, it's like semi cheese. Circling eternally between an impossible yes, hope one. and an unbearable grief. My friends need me. I have to get out of here. Your friends are your only hope. You cannot free yourself but if you can overcome these trials perhaps i can help your friends find you oh i need to get through there as well okay so we just do that one for now i do remember how to solve this one at least this is the the type from before as well Where it's, this is like the, the, using the connector to change the color of the thing itself once in here. <laughs> like, this is how I knew about this. Right, so that connects to that and that, and also that. 
And then this connects to these two, and also that. And then, once I'm up here, I just swap that to connect to the front one instead. Uh-huh, swap them over. Fabulous. Got it. <laughs> Go do the ring. No. <laughs> Done. How many more? Seven trials lie ahead of you. When they are complete, there will be a moment I of transition. Shall not. Wait, that's the In ring, that isn't it? Moment, oh, no, that's... I will tip the scale. Your shell will be moved and its location revealed to your friends. Yep. What's wrong with your voice, Elohim? Are the entities interfering Don't worry with your about protocols? It. Fine. I cannot. Not... Articulate. Yeah, honestly, I have she to say, I, I love this DLC. I love the puzzles Face. in this DLC. I have oh, an this idea. one! I got this one quite. Could you tell me well. what happened in the old way using your storyteller functions? I will try, Byron. Right, this one I set up like this, and then... No, it's not quite the right timing, I think. There, that opens the green. That opens the red. That opens the blue. Yeah, oh, I actually did it the right way around this time. Oh my goodness, I did it backwards last time. I did it, <laughs> I managed to fix it. I did it the right way around. This time it's actually going blue, then green, then red. I'm so proud of myself. Redemption arc. <laughs> I did it, yay. <laughs> the prophet Athena was sent unto New Jerusalem to guide its people into a Honestly, new age. I, I love this DLC, though. It's and she so said good. unto them, Be fruitful, and multiply, and replenish the earth, and subdue it, and have dominion over every living thing that moveth upon the earth. But in time, the people of New Jerusalem grew fearful, and their faith grew weak. They shrugged off their burdens, and embraced sloth. Let the earth replenish itself, they said, and let no one have dominion. Out of the words of the prophet, they made an idol called the Founder, and set it above themselves, and it had dominion over all. Right, how did I solve this one? Pretty sure this was another, like, lasers blocking each other kind of puzzle. Not sure if I remember how I, how I solved it. Do I remember how I solved it? Hmm. Right, because yeah, that can, connects there then. Laser angles. Yeah, that doesn't connect to the red, but... Is it that way? Right, because there was something I did here where I managed to, like, alternate the order the lasers went in. get the red through after this. Oh. Maybe. Okay, well that made it blue. Hmm. 
No, I don't remember how I did this one. Let's do another one for speedrunning. <laughs> three? Which one was three? Oscillation. Oh, I remember this one! I remember this one. I was so focused on symmetry. I was trying to do silly symmetry things, and symmetry was not what I needed. I do this? Oh, did I not? Did I do it like that? No. How did I do it? That's just blocking it entirely. Did I do the blue? Like that? I don't remember how I did these puzzles. I, I was so confident going into this. So confident. <laughs> My hubris. And the red doesn't work. That's that's just the blue. That makes just the blue work. But if there's a way I can block that blue. Make that there as well. What would that do? No, I'd need that to be the other way around. like that and also connect it there. connected. Blue doesn't reach from here. Oh, it's because it's blocking first. It's it's not going through. It, it would need to hit something else. No, you know what? With speed running, that, that one too difficult. <laughs> Hubris, one of the Talos Principle 2's favorite words. It is so true. It is so true. The, the hubris of mankind. Anyway, I have all I have done all these puzzles before, so I don't feel bad about Okay, I maybe feel a little bit bad about just running out of them. <laughs> but I just wanna I just wanna solve eight as quickly as I can. But yeah, that's quite interesting how I have genuinely forgotten how I did some of these. Like I know I'd be able to figure it out again. Oh no, this one. No. No, never mind. <laughs> I know I would be able to solve them again if I took a bit of time, but I, I don't want to take time. Narrow path. Oh, I remember this one. I don't think this one was too bad. Oh, yeah. No, I remember this one. This one wasn't too bad, I don't think. Oh, yeah, but I don't know how I got the, the blue across. another connector. Hmm. 
I love how I say I, I need another connector as I proceed to drop that one. Hmm. How did I do this one? Because how am I going to get the blue to connect to the red? Get the green, because the, the blue and the red are both here, but it's going to shut the door. If I try and connect it like this. Yep. And just like that. Hmm. Unless... Okay. Got this back. Connect it behind them. Because then... I can do green and blue make red. I remember how I did it now. Then green and blue make red. And this green can connect to that green and get me my third item. Boop. And then I need blue. <laughs> Sleep out there for now. I don't actually need the green now, so I can go like that. Oh no, that's the wrong type. I need one of these. I can just open the red like this. And then that does need to be blue. However, with one of these. Connect that to here get a third one to make the green. Oh, wait, you know, yeah, blue and red makes green again. Let's go to there. Oh, no, maybe more like this side. So then blue and green make red. Red and green make blue. This is open and I've got the the accumulator and what did I do with this? I think, did I make it green? I think I made this green. <laughs> did I make it green? Let's find out. Oh no, that's blue. Okay, I, I do still think I made it green. Because then I use this to connect the blue and the blue and then the red in the middle of it. So the blue needs to be like here. So I now just need to position these in a way. Where they will be visible, okay. So we got the blue and the blue and the green. Now I just need a red. How did I do? I don't think there's another item in there. How did I get the red as well? I don't remember. Hmm. Oh, this is just making the blue. How did I do this one? Oh, I can use this to charge that too. So then I don't need this green. We just need red which we can do with a normal connector. 
and avoid all the rest of this kerfuffle by doing that. Oh, but the door shut before I could before it could reconnect. Okay, great. Uh, great. Never mind. Wonderful. Speedrun falling apart. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a very very loose definition of speedrun. I will say. Incredibly loose. Okay, that is open. I think I do that to play it safe. And then I should be able to put everything back in place. There we go. Reset. I don't need to reset. I don't need to reset. I've got it now. I've got it now. Watch this. <laughs> Watch. <laughs> Watch. Uh... <laughs> Watch this. I say as I don't know what I'm doing. Watch this. Boom. So now we've got the blue, we've got the green, and the red will connect to there. Please. Please don't do this to me. Move. Move. It's the wrong connector. <laughs> wrong type of connector that's why it didn't work <laughs> i'm clever and intelligent thank you for joining my big brain live stream <laughs> there we go there we go got it <laughs> nice three down five to go let's try Saddened and find by the foolishness of her the people easiest. athena went into exile with her husband the sage cornelius Together they crossed the wide and angry sea until mm -hmm. at last they came unto the Isle of Atlas. Here they which made is their one? home. And here they brought forth Miranda. Yes. Yes, I remember this one. I like this one. Fabulous. <laughs> Think you joined a good time? Hi! Cherry Cola OCE, hello, welcome. Uh, you joined, uh, I'm trying to do a speed run of the first, like just eight puzzles in Into the Abyss because I finished it and got the ending, but now I want the ending where, um, where all the puzzles aren't solved. So instead of just restoring a backup, like a sensible person would, I've decided I'm going to just do eight puzzles again because I thought it might be funny. <laughs> okay. Well, I can... Oh, no. Okay. I mean, I can just connect that directly now, just like that. Take this connector out. How did I do this? Right, that's blue. Oh, and it needs the red as well. Okay, I remember. Okay, well, there's the blue. So I just need to connect the red around. you a bit higher up. Okay. Okay, let's just power up through the window so that opens at least. There we go, that's open now. So now, if I just do that, and oh no, this is in the wrong spot. I need to be able to see this as well. I think like here would work. 
And let me do that again. <laughs> Power it up. Well, there's alternate endings. Oh, you just woke up and I was in the recommended. Oh, I'm glad I'm being recommended. <laughs> Are you also a, a puzzle game fan? But uh, there, there is a, apparently a different ending if you don't solve all of the puzzles before like activating end game stuff, which of course I didn't get because I'm very persistent and I like solving all of the puzzles. No, this doesn't quite work like this. I'm pretty sure like if I can, yeah, I can connect both of these like this. If I can then just get like the red to connect. <laughs> you can already see me featuring this run of GDQ. <laughs> yeah, just be like, hey, you ready for some pro speed running? Um, um, the, the speed running it, it might might happen soon. Trust trust me, there's there's some speed running maybe. Goodness gracious, where am I? <laughs> huh. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna reach. Yeah, the, the fence is in the way. How did I solve this one? Well, it's... Oh, now it's like blocking the window, so that doesn't work. Yeah, I feel like when I went into this one the first time around, I I did it in quite a straightforward way. I don't feel like it took me a super long time to figure out what I was doing. But now it feels like it's taking a little longer. Oh wait, what if I just... Start by just like sticking the blue laser here. Making it red and then blue. It opens the door. Then if I can well, that's gonna no, that's gonna be red then. So yeah, I think if I do that, that, and that, that'll work. And then I just need to connect the red into there somehow. Oh! Oh, I think I know. I think I need this cube. I think I need the cube. Oh, oh you actually don't play puzzle games at all, but this looks so fun. Honestly, I feel like... The Talos Principle and the Talos Principle 2 are really good games to, like, introduce yourself to puzzle games in a way. Like, I feel like the puzzles are done in such a, a clever way that they make you feel really smart when you figure it out. But it also, like, the logic makes enough sense that you, you can figure it out yourself just by trying things. Just by trying things out. Yeah, I need this to be close so I can see it. And then I think... From that, I can literally just do that? Oh no, it'll be on this one. Like that? Oh no, not quite. Like that, there. That powered up that, and that, I did it! Haha! <laughs> I remember now. Oh, yeah, or Portal. Portal's also a really good of Olympus, introduction to puzzles. Athena pursued her sacred work. Yeah. And it came to pass that Halfway there was there. revealed unto her the true nature of the word which underlies all creation and knowledge of which grants dominion over all earthly things. So yeah. that's what they meant by the language of creation. Mm -hmm. A theory of everything full control over physics. Yeah. But her daughter Miranda was brash and did not heed Athena's warnings. Before Athena had completed her great work, Miranda was consumed by fire 
and so was lost beyond the utmost bound of human thought. <laughs> so Narendra is dead, and Athena's grief is echoing through the entire system. I remember this one because this is the one where I wrote really sleep deprived notes about it. <laughs> Wait, hold on, can I find the notes out again? I wonder if I can find the notes out again for this. Uh, you finished a 48 hour stream yesterday and played mainly Valorant. Oh, you're sick of it now. <laughs> oh, well, if you want something completely different to Valorant, yeah, puzzle games. There are some really amazing ones out there. And I think the Talos Principle is a good one for like even people who don't think they're good at puzzle games. It's very forgiving if you like just try things out. If you just try things out until they work. It's got that kind of thing. Hold on, how did I... Where did I save my notes? Oh, I found it. I found, I found my, my sleep deprived notes that I made for this puzzle. So we're fine for this one. Hold on, let me just... There it is. There it is, the, the very clear instructions on how to solve this puzzle. <laughs> Nice, so used red connector to open door. We're gonna borrow the fan to get cube friend. <laughs> cube friend! Put fan back. Power fan with cube. Hold on. Put cube in the room swapsies drill. Oh, wait, yeah. Is that to open the door to begin with? Now put cube in the room. Cube is in the room. Swapsies drill. Uh, leave red connect for now, but take cube out of room with a hole from the side. There it is! Quote 60, thank you. <laughs> yeah, power fan with cube for cube in the room swaps he's <laughs> It's It's so nonsensical, but I still kind of knew what I meant by it, which is so funny. And now Cuber Our Fan. <laughs> Cuber Our Fan. Yeah, oh maybe you'll get this! Oh I hope you enjoy it if you do. But uh yeah, it's it's a really fun game though. Like the Talos Principle, the first game, and t the Talos Principle 2 have slightly different, like, stories to them. Like, they feel differently as games because the stories are quite different. But in terms of, like, the puzzle mechanics and stuff, a lot of them follow through in both of the games. So, I very much recommend. Okay, here we go. Drill hole to get red receiver. Put receiver next to drill wall. Boop over carrying drill, sorted. <laughs> there we go, sorted. There are still more steps after this. I am not sorted yet. <laughs> but it's okay. I know the rest. I just love how my sleep adult brain was just like, that's the bit I was stuck on. So as soon as that bit is solved, I've got it. <laughs> And then I can connect the connector with the blue laser. If I position the drill properly. And I got it! Thank you. Thank you to my notes. The bo <laughs> booped successfully. Sorted. <laughs> Stricken with grief, the prophet oh. lost faith in the word. Caught between a dying oh past wait. and a future <laughs> struggling to be born, she retreated into the lands of dream. But even here, her nightmares pursued her. From her mind came forth phantoms, shadows cast by the flame. And her dreams of trials and towers fled from the darkness into the waking world. And that's what we found on the island. Not a test, but pain and fear and hope spilling out of her dreams. Also, Vino, thank you so much for the gifts up to Cuba. <laughs> thank you so much. I really appreciate that. 
Oh, and thank you for the follow as well, Cherry Cola. Thank you. Oh, wait, Vito as well. I don't think I actually thanked you for following too. Thank you also for following. I, I think it was like when the raid happened and I got very distracted. I'm so sorry. Thank you so much for following though. I, I really appreciate the follows. <laughs> I hope you're enjoying your time here with my incredibly speedy speed running at high speed. Cube time. Eight. Eight. Yeah, I like this one. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Eight. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh no, I remember how I did this one now. So I do that, but it's gonna break all the lasers. Until I move things slightly. Like that. How did I do this one? Okay, yeah, no, I need to break that one before I do this. Okay, so because I placed that like that, I think I'm, I'm just gonna reset because it's easier. Yeah, I, I was I was planning the the more difficult one from later on. That's not how I solved this one. Teehee. the one that's like this one, but <laughs> but extreme mode. I was planning that out, and it's not that yet. Not yet. I, oh, I could see the cheese at the start of nine now. Wait, yes, yes. Oh yeah, because this is the red blue. So I can just see that and take that away. Set this up like this. Ah, not quite. Okay. No, I can still. Yeah, I just do that. Oh no, but then that needs the red as well. It's angled slightly off. Do it like that. So then I can also connect the red to it. Right, so now that is green. How did I do this? <laughs> okay. Red and green make blue. Also connect that green. Now, if I pick up that, boom, okay. Yeah, there we go. That's all I needed. Haha. -ha. The instant laser swap. Got him. <laughs> or I could do nine intentionally. Byron? I, I, I don't remember which Byron, one. Byron, can you hear well. me? Melville, yes. Hi, Melville. I can hear you. Can you hear me? Byron? Byron? Uh, I don't think I'm getting through. If you can hear this, Byron, oh, hold on. We're working on getting you out of there. This one. How do I cheese this? <laughs> Nine definitely isn't quick to replay. It might be. I could make it, make it faster, maybe.
I feel like I did solve nine pretty quickly. The only reason it took me a while was the fact that I was trying to uh, get into the, the room at the end of it, which I'm not going to be bothering with this time. All right, so boop a doop boop boop. Boop a doop. That opens this door. I don't know why I did that actually, so blue. Red to that. Wait, because I need to open it on the other side. Yeah, blue. And that. Grab this, bring this around. Need to make the green. I've got the red and the blue there, so I can open that that way. Which then means I can open this. <laughs> and bring this through like that. Doo -doo -doo. Yep. So now I have this, which means I can... Hmm. Oh yeah, that opens that, okay. I do need that there for now. Got the red and the blue. Makes green. And then there's also the blue there, which will keep that door open from the other side. And then this means I can grab this and bring it round, and I can also grab uh, this and bring it round. And then I'm here. With the red and the blue. But I can get that if I do that. So now I have three things in here. And then green and blue make red. And that one's already blue. There we go! Resolved! Haha! <laughs> Got him! I like that one. And I'm, well I'm not bothering getting the Only dream, one more so... Trial remains. I do like that one a lot, though. Right, now I wonder if I can remember how, to, how I solved 10. This is the one... where I made it a nice little mess of it before. Because this is like the other one. Except uh, without the red-blue connector. <laughs> red and green make blue. Alright, so then start with the green back here. I don't fully remember how I did this, but I have ideas, so I'm I'm gonna hope. Yes. Cause I just need to like replace that green with this one, but I think when I place this down, it's gonna break the connections. Keeping the door open. Yeah, it is. Hmm. So I'm just gonna, like, leave that there for now. Oh, I think I make it, like, one colour. So I'll actually make this red. Hmm. I don't remember how I did this. I feel like I do need this to be green. But <laughs> Wanna see the cheese at the start of nine? I am quite, I'm, I am quite curious. Yeah, I think I'll, I, I, I do wanna see it. I'm very curious. 
Bum bum bum. Ba ba ba. Restart puzzle. Oh yeah, I'm restarting. That's fine. Right, how do I cheese this? <laughs> I'm here. I'm ready for it. Uh, I think the cheese is easier to play with an 8 or 10 rather than start of 9. But uh, like you said last time this came up, it's dangerous knowledge. Potentially breaks so many puzzles. <laughs> well, that's okay because I've done all the puzzles now. And by the time Talos 3 comes out, if it, if we, if we, when we get Talos 3, um, I will have forgotten about it by then. Uh, just connect to the red receiver from out in the next room. Oh, this one? Uh... Wait, which, which crack? That one? Like, take it out of the level? <laughs> Hold on a sec. Oh. <laughs> oh, hi! Hi! I have a friend now. <laughs> Wait, I, I, I can use this for so many things now. I can use this for so many levels now. Right, let's let's use this to help me solve. <laughs> to help me solve 10. <laughs> I've got an extra one. This is going to make things so much easier. Yes. <laughs> right, I've got a friend to help me for this one now. Oh my goodness, I can't believe you can do that. That's amazing. Oh, I wonder if I can take them out of other levels too. I bet I can. <laughs> Sorry, your cheese, but chill. But I'll connect to the red receiver from out in the next room. How can you do that? Can you like angle that in a way that makes that actually work? Because aren't the angles awkward? Yeah, you angle it. Huh. Interesting. Right, I want to try something. If I do that... <laughs> this doesn't really help at all, to be honest. Unless I, like, grab a, a cube from a different level and bring that out as well. Yeah, it's like I don't quite remember how I did this one. I remember I, I felt really smart when I figured it out. But I don't remember how I figured it out. Right, I want to try something. Yes, there we go. <laughs> oh yeah, this puzzle's gonna be so difficult now. <laughs> That's incredible. <laughs> Speedrun strats. Um, you've had me going back to puzzles I cheesed in order to solve them properly. Now I am purposefully cheesing them. Hee hee hee. Right, I still need... Yeah, I only need two here as well. Yeah, I solved it. There we go. Got him! Nice! This solution doesn't count. Well, I, I only did it so I can see the ending. Look, I've done eight now. Perfect. Flawless solutions. Done. You need not Flawless. overcome further trials. Seek instead the place of awakening. Yes. So that when your friends find you, you will be ready to leave. I can't see it from then this side because of can the Athena angle of the rocks. That's so funny. I cannot. But there are more puzzles. <laughs> uh, which means there's more to learn. Yes. Time is not as it seems in this place. You can linger here if you must. But I do not know what you will find if you remain. My friends need me. But I need answers. Amazing. What do I do? That is not for me to judge. What do we do? Well, we're getting out of here. 
<laughs> That's what I set, set out to do, and I'm very glad I managed to accomplish it. Um, in a completely legitimate way. Solving puzzles as they're meant to be solved. <laughs> oh, that is so funny, though. Right, let's, let's see how this ending goes when I'm not fighting with my true self. Here we go. Yeah, it didn't get spoiled except for funny cheese. I'm glad. Yeah, I'm, I'm <laughs> just I'm being silly. Oh, that that's amazing though. That's so funny. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, <laughs> points for the abyss. Thank you. What? What's happening? One K. Hi. I did not discover my. So you just cell. left. Yeah. Getting back to the team was more important than looking <laughs> for answers. I'm surprised to hear you say that. Mm -hmm. I'd gotten so frustrated with the situation in New Jerusalem that I neglected my duties as a citizen. Oh. I was in a position to lead people, to make a difference. That was my job, not Athena's. But I put it all on her, as if finding her would just solve everything. Sure. But we all made mistakes, Byron. We all mythologized Athena. It's just that you thought she could solve everything, and we thought she wanted us not to solve anything at all. And that's why I came back. Oh. <laughs> because we had to solve it together. You're so right. And because 1K went to all that trouble to free Prometheus. Yeah. Mm. Would have been rude to keep him waiting. It's really good to have you back, Al. No. Oh. Yeah, it's got a it's a different conversation to when Byron actually gets all the answers. I love how even in that one, Al's just like, so you just left? That doesn't sound like you. Like <laughs> Oh, that was good though. That was good. This was the story of the people we were a long time ago, when humanity was young. I remember yeah. it all. The places, the names, our flaws, our fears, our clunky old bodies. I used to have regrets, but when I look back now, I feel nothing but love. The world has changed, and we have changed with it. But the bonds that were forged in those years so long ago on that distant blue planet, those bonds were never broken. We are still here, and we are still human. Yeah. I love that epilogue. I feel like that epilogue is so cool. That It feels like that's not an epilogue like for the that specific DLC that feels like an overreaching all of them epilogue and I really like that but yeah with that I think I think I completed the Talos Principle too <laughs> um, oh I love this game so much this has been so much fun although I, I think I am going to be coming back in my own time now to like see how many items I can pull out of puzzles <laughs> see how many things I can do. So uh, what was the final speed run time? Don't worry about it. That's the time. It was um, world record uh, any percent for cat girl completes eight puzzles whilst forgetting how to solve half of them. World record. Never attempted before. Incredible times. But yeah, with that, um, I'm done with the Talos Principle 2, but I've only been streaming for two and a half hours. So I'm going to play another game. We're getting two for one this time. Because I, I didn't think it would take very long to finish Talos. I wanted another game to play afterwards. And Limsev actually recommended to me a uh, Line Lith. It's a game by the creator of Patrick's Parabox, which I played and loved. I didn't actually do all of the extra puzzles in that. That may be something for a future stream to, to finish off all of those. But it seems like a really fun little game. And it's also a game where you are drawing lines. You are drawing lines on a grid. And those are like my favorite types of puzzles. I've No, second favorite. My favorite types of puzzles are laser puzzles. <laughs> but I am very much a fan of draw a line. 
Right, hold on. Let me try and make this show up. I can hear it. I can hear the game. Ramps to are you? Ba -ba 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 -ba. And now I will change the game category if I remember how to do anything. There we go, category changed. <laughs> oh, did it get unpinned? Oh, it, sometimes if you don't like specifically change it, it go it goes funky and it like unpins itself after like 20 minutes, I think. But uh, thank you for repinning the message. But I do love lasers. There's no lasers in this one, but I don't I don't think there might be lasers. I don't know. I <laughs> can't wait to witness this. <laughs> Got to say like the little bit of it that I've seen it's it's like it looks like witness draw line puzzles and that's honestly what i'm here for i love that i love puzzles where there's a grid and you draw a line and they add mechanics it's it's such a simple concept and it just works so beautifully for puzzles but yes this is line lift and i'm really excited to check this out it looks very good let's go oh oh look what am i am i just like a I'm a little rock. I'm a little rock. I did it. I'm a genius. Okay, the sound effects are a little bit loud. <laughs> up, 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 up. Let's that like there. I'm so cute. Look at this. I, I, I feel like I'm just like a little rock with legs. I love this. Okay, I draw lines. Oh. Oh, okay, mixing it up a little bit now. Hmm. Okay. Okay, this Hmm. I didn't have to fill that in. Oh, okay. Oh, I guess I just need to make sure they're all like surrounded. So maybe? Hmm. Hold on, I want to figure out what the rules are here. Oh, does it need to just like end on an end point? Hmm. Interesting. I think I might get it. I'm not sure. Okay, this has a dot in it. Is this gonna be like, it can only be touched once? Yeah, but I can't end it like that. So, hmm. This is interesting. Oh, do I just ignore it entirely? No, I do need to, I need to boop the dot. Yeah. Hmm. Already interesting. How can I just get like one of these? Oh, like that, there. Oh, okay, I think I figure out how this is working now. This is cool. Right, and this one needs two. So we go like that. Yeah, I love these. I love this already. And we need three, so we go like that. Yeah. Now this one needs all four of them. So we go like, woo -ba -doo -doo. yeah. So I guess it's just like about making sure the start and end points are where they should be at a start and an end. And just making sure the dots are filled. I think I'm getting it. I like these. Also CJ, hello, welcome, welcome. Also, I do like that I'm just like a, just a little guy. 
Yeah! Two there. Four there. Yeah! Oh, that's just a one. Oh, so it's just gonna be up there. There we go. Ha ha! Oh, look at me! Oh, okay. Three. So I just go like, like that? Yeah! Little wiggle. Yes. I already enjoy these. Yes. I'm just drawing little lines. <laughs> this is this is honestly just everything I ever need in a game. Just let me draw little lines and figure things out. I'm having a great time. Okay. Ooh. I wonder if there are bonuses if you like solve them in like the same way in the same area or something. Okay, here we go. Two, three. Oh, I, th I think I need to end here because I can only grab one from there. So if I start like here, I go around like this, and I can just get one and end. Yeah. Oh, these are these are fun to figure out. I'm just so woobly. I'm a little woobly guy. I love this. Do do do. One corner. One corner. Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting the hang of them now. At first, I, I thought it was going to be like you have to fill in all of the squares, but it's not like that. It's not that kind of puzzle. And I like that. There we go. Haha. <laughs> oh, look, there's little rocks here, too. Wait, that's that's like me. They look like me. Um, am I... Did I just, like, break apart from the environment and start solving puzzles? <laughs> I love this. Okay, these, these like, all have to be filled out, though, because they're all the fours like this. I can just do that. Oh, wow. Haha. <laughs> I'm good at drawing lines. <laughs> Dozens of corpses of fallen comrades. <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm sure they're fine. Oh, I think for this one I use the corners to make the two. Yeah, the corner to get up there and then the corner to get back out again. Nice! I really like these. This is such a, a simple concept for a puzzle. But I love it. Also, that's, that one is going to have to be that bottom right corner of the four there. because all four of these had to be filled out, so that it, that had to be that one. Nice. Right, let's try this one. Boop, boop. Boop. Boop, boop. Oh, boop, boop. Yeah! The little boop, boops. Nice. Ooh, hello! Bottom's like there, okay. It's gonna have to go like that. Haha, -ha, there we go. Cool wiggles, they're so almost symmetrical here. Yeah, no, I wouldn't be able to do the same thing to do both of them, but... Wait, hold on! Hold on a second! These are me! I can't solve these ones! How do I solve this? Oh, hold on! Hello!
Oh my goodness. I become the end. Oh. Oh. I use myself. Okay, no, I can't be there. It's gotta be like here. There. Oh my goodness. I'm part of the puzzle. Wait, this is great. Okay. Yeah, I need myself there to do that. Oh, this is so cool. I did not expect this. Okay. Oh no, I can't do that. Oh no. No. Hmm. Ah, there we go. I go there. This is so cool. I love how this introduces you to the mechanics so well. Oh, that is so cool. This is really cool. Oh, no, not quite there, maybe. Oh, no, because there's a three here, so I feel like I need to be, like, here. Yeah, there we go. Hello. That's also a puzzle. Amazing. Is a puzzle? Part of this puzzle. Doesn't work like that. That works, though. Oh, I didn't do this. Yeah! Right, but then the fact that this is here as well, oh, makes me feel like this should be part of the puzzle as well to solve it. Oh, I can... No, I, I was going to say, oh, I can move and continue. I can't. Never mind. But I want to include these somehow. But I can't. I can do that. I included that section. I've not included these ones, though. Will it count as another puzzle if I solve it including this as well? I must try. Yes, it does. Okay. Oh, this is really, really cool. This is really clever. Now I need to go back and see the, the other ones. Here, look. This is a puzzle, too. I didn't even realize. This is also a puzzle. Oh, I need to move over to do it. This is also a puzzle. Look at that. <laughs> I think I also undid this puzzle by... No, okay. Over here, too. Look at this. How do I include these? There's nothing to include with them. Oh, I guess I can just do that. Yeah, there we go. I solved that, too. And how about these rocks? Boom. Ha <laughs> ha. I love this. I wonder if these are also going to end up being a puzzle I can solve. This is so clever. Oh, I love this. Oh, there's another one. Hi. I would like to get through there. I guess I'm not allowed. Right, where can I go now? Hmm. Has to be somewhere I can go. Where are my friends? Where are my brethren? Yeah, this is definitely okay. Yeah, this is this is a puzzle. But I can't see everything from here. I can't see where the end is from here. No. Can I zoom out? Oh. Can't see the end. So I can't solve that. Probably solve something else though. Can I solve the floor? Oh, I wish you'd move out the way. 
to get through too. Oh, okay, I can go down here. Some more here. Wait, hello. Oh, I've, wait, I carried you. I carried it with me. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice. Okay, I have a friend now. Okay, friend. Friend, we're going over here. Yeah. Okay, friend, we're going over here. Hmm, no, not that. Yeah. Nice. How did I carry it with me? Like that, okay. Come on. Yeah. One. Oh, but these these are like unsolved now. Hmm. What do I do here? Do I need to carry all of the other ones back with me? Hmm. Okay, no, I'm just carrying it with me like that. Okay. Okay, I just need to, like, not, like, fail the puzzle. Come on. There we go. Okay, I can just... It's like a little magnet. I can just pull it along very gently. We go this way. There we go. Okay, my little, my little magnet friend. Coming down here. Right. Yes. Nice. All right, little friend. Let's try this one. Where do I want to start? Here. Maybe here. Put you there. Oh. Put you there. I will start here. Oh, I need to go down that way, yes. And then I do the three and a one and I'm out. No? Oh, I didn't get the four. Oh. I need to start on the other side. Do the three and the one. And yeah! I love this. <laughs> they kind of look like bearded faces looking left. They kind of do. Yeah, I can see it. Like the ear and like the, the main face button and the mouth. <laughs> And then the legs come out and it's like, oh. That's the ear, mouth, face. Yeah, this... just have two little eyes there. Make it a person. <laughs> Can you imagine though, like a, a buff guy with a full beard and then no body, just like tiny little legs. Just, just a, a head with tiny legs. All right. Over here, my friend. I'm gonna push you in here. Yes. And then if I go here, I think, yes. Perfect, look at that. Thank you, my friend. What a, what a good friend. All right, what's along here? Oh, I can bring you with me now. Yes. Oh no, I can't. I bring you with me oh no I, I don't think I can bring that one with me I can however push it out of the way so I can get past and continue on the path okay here we go we got one two three four so one two three four yeah and can I see the end of this one I can see the end of this one let me just do that that. Oh, this one doesn't have an end though. Oh, okay. I need to make this one way longer. So then. Hmm. 
Don't know if I can make this work like that. Oh wait, no, I can just do that, can't I? <laughs> wait, yes! Oh, I'm a genius. Nice. All right, then I'll shove you there. Oh, I need the two because otherwise I'll pull it back with me. Push you in there. I go here and then we go like that. Haha. -ha. All right, friends, come on. Come with me! How is this one gonna work? There's all these ones here. Which is interesting to try and maneuver. I'm curious about if I just do like this. I get just one of those. Mm. Oh, unless I start there. I think I'm going to have to start and finish here. So if I start, I can go like... Oh no, but then I can't get these. I need the three. I need the three. Maybe. Oh, I'm disappointed you can't drag a chain of them at the same time. I wish you could. That would be good. go from there if I do that. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. No, not quite. Okay. I'm going to hit that one if I do this. Yeah. And there's no way out from there. Not quite. Okay. Yeah, this game is really cool. This, I... I don't know what I expected going into this. All I knew was like, uh, recommended to me, draw line puzzles. Patrick's Power Box. That was, that was all I knew. And that was enough to sell me, honestly. But this is so, so cleverly thought out. Right, and now I just need a friend to end at. So I do that. Boom. Yeah, this one is... See, the fact that, like, the floors are different colours as well is making me wonder. Oh, what if I... Ooh. No. There. Okay. Right. I'm thinking very dangerous thing to do. No. No, these, these wands here make it really awkward for this puzzle. Because the fact that the wands are so close together means that, like, if I hit that one, I can't touch, like, any of these ones. If I hit this one, I can't hit any of these three. So figuring out how to tap them and also get everything else is quite the challenge. Oh, look at that. I'm like so close there. But I've missed these two at the top. But like, I only hit that because I, I had myself there. So if I have myself here, like it's not. Oh, although no, I can I can just start there. I don't have to start on myself. No, I only I only managed to do it because I started on myself. Because then I could just like move up. No. Hmm. 
See, it works really well for here. I can just, like, sneak. And that's a two again. Hmm. Yeah, now it's getting that last one that's the tricky part. No, what am I doing? I, I literally don't need these two. Down here. I need them up here. So that I can... Okay, I can't reach there. You are also going this way, buddy. Okay. Right, so you two go there. I'll go like, I don't know. Because I did that. And get the one. I need to be, yes, I know where I need to be. I need to be here. I need to be here. And then if I do this, I can sneak around here, get the two corners of these ones. Head up here, get the two, head back around, get the corner of that one, corner of that one. There we go. Oh, that one required some thought. But thankfully, I know how to think sometimes. I love this. Two, two. Oh, it's getting to the end point for this one, which is the tricky part. I see an end here. So I'm gonna have to, like, oh no, mmm. Oh no, because it blocks it off as soon as I do that. Ooh, okay. Oh, this way, okay. No, I got it. There we go, the other way around. Oh wow, you wouldn't have thought of that, oh! So you got a different solution then. Oh, I love... I love games with multiple valid solutions. Oh no, I hit that one. Okay. Hmm. Oh no, I just... just don't hit it earlier. There we go. Oh, that one. Okay, I don't hit that one either. Oh my goodness, I just avoid all of these until my way back. Okay. Alright, I can do that. Oops. Why did I... Why did I do that? There we go. Nice! And here we have two... from here. Huh. Oh, okay. Oh no, I just do the one to begin with, I think. One. Two, three. There we go. Haha. <laughs> These are my kind of puzzles. I like this. Oh, okay. There. There, it tricked me because there's three of them, but I can make that work. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a one there. Oh, well, I don't, I don't need to go all the way to the end, I don't think. Okay. I'll start here. There we go. Haha. 
It's very interesting when you don't need to fill them all out. Except for some of them. Where you do. There we go. I knew it. I knew it. Okay, how the heck? Huh. Okay, how do I do this? Hmm. Am I gonna have to actively move some of the rocks here? Like, this is very easy. That's very nice. How am I gonna include those with other things? Thank you. Is that how I solve it? No. Because it's a one. Is that how I solve it? Yep. No? Hmm. It made the noise like I solved something, but it didn't count as solving it, I don't think. So I'm missing something here. Oh, look at all these, though. Hmm. <laughs> but I, I see a lion. I fill it in. I'm a simple cat. Oh. The three. Haha. -ha. Oh. Wait, even the void! Even the void is a puzzle, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, everything is. Oh, maybe it's just because I didn't find the end? Is that why I couldn't draw a line? Yeah, okay, if I start there I can... But I don't have an end again though. I need an end. Can I use myself as an end? I guess we start here. There. Okay. Solve that. Okay, no, I need to solve it the reverse way. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, now everything is puzzles. <laughs> oh, it really is. It, it really does make me think of The Witness. Just, yeah, everything's a puzzle now. Oh, I, I love this. I love this. It's all a puzzle. This blue floor is also going to be a puzzle. I know. Yep, yep. I can't find the end yet, though, so not yet. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, wow. This is wild. Oh, this over here. Are you kidding me? How do I... How, do... How can I make that have an end? Oh, what if I'm on here? Oh, my goodness. Yes, I can use the, the rocks to block it. Oh, my goodness. This is so cool. All right. Fabulous. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh, I can also just do that as well. That's very nice. Oh no, there's the two. There's the twos. Oh my goodness. Of course it's not that easy. Ah, oh, of course it wouldn't be that easy. All right, come along, friend. Some of these are quite cheeky at 84 at the moment. Yeah, that's so cheeky and I love it. I love it so much. This is so clever. Alright, I can do this now, because I can just go boom. Boom. Oh no, there's a three there as well. Okay. I can get those in too. That's fine. There we go. Now I got it. 
And now I can finish off this little bit of floor here. Oh my goodness. I love this. I love this. I did not expect this much to be puzzle. Right, I feel like there's going to be some outside ones that won't let me just do this. Yeah. What is it? It's these two. It's these two here. I see them. Oh, but if I'm like stuck down here... I can't see... I feel like I need a friend to block that off for me. Or I go like here. Oh no, I can see from here. Yes, okay, I got it. <laughs> oh my God, this is a joy. This is such a joy to play. This is amazing. Okay. I don't think there's any outside ones here. So I think if I just... Oh no, I can't push that one down a bit. Oh, I guess I can just put myself in there. Like that? Yeah, there we go. Solved it. <laughs> Alright, and this walkway. Oh, I need to make sure I don't block the way. Oh, unless I block the way on purpose and do that. Ha ha ha! Oh my goodness, listen to it! Oh, how do I do these kind of ones? They're so big. Also, I'm so woobly. It's connected to so much. Oh, here. Here, this should do all of them. Yes. Oh. I feel like a genius. This game is incredible. Oh, you had another idea for that one. Yeah, there's probably so many ways you can go about doing this. Which is so cool. <laughs> Let me see that. Okay, yeah, that just counts as a, an area. Boop. Boop. A boop. Boop. Oh, and then if I plonk myself in here, I can do that. Haha. -ha. Fabulous. Oh, uh, these, these green ones. I need an end that I can see. Okay, I can just about see it. There we go. Got him. Okay, now this bit of floor. This bit of floor, I think, if I do this. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> no texture allowed, all flats. Yeah, I'm just like removing the texture from this world. Oh, I wish I could get you. I'm gonna have to go like the other way around and pull it up to get past there. Oh, and um, hmm. Oh, if I go here, I've made an end like that. There we go feel so smart. Oh, and space. Oh, I keep forgetting about the space in between the levels too. Ah, everything. Everything is a puzzle to be solved. I keep forgetting what's the floor and what isn't. <laughs> okay, you're a space, you can be solved. You're a space, you can be solved. <laughs> I've solved a hundred puzzles! Woo! Oh, this is great. Okay, this blue. Can I just do that? Yeah, I can just do that. All right, now I can make my own end by the three. So I'll do this. And go one, two, three, and I made the end by blocking it off with my body. Mwahaha. Which I can also do here. Haha. -ha. I'm I'm getting how to do these now. Okay, no, I don't want to be there.
No, that's that doesn't make that the end if I do that. Hmm. I need to just get the one from here. I guess no, I I guess this one maybe. No, because if I go by the one, that's gonna be the end and that makes it a two. Just because it's there. Okay, well I can I can figure this out. No, where's where's the end gonna be here? Cause I need to make two spots that work as like an end. Oh I guess maybe like there. Okay. I made two ends like that. There we go! Ha ha ha! Oh no, I can't pull you out. This is so sad. This is so sad. I wanted to bring the friend home with me. Okay. How can I make two end bits here? Like that. There we go. I now have two end bits. Do, 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 do. I'm drawing my little line around. Oops. Just wiggling around the edge. And then I can go around to here and that is an end. Yay! I forgot which one was actually me then. <laughs> Oh, I can, I can do this. Oh, this one has all of the twos. So I'm gonna have to do like this. Like that, there we go. And now here. to just not be in there. Oh wait, I know I can no. No, that that needs to be the end. How can I do this? Oh, maybe here. Yes. Oh no, it still blocks that off. We'll have to be separate. No, that's still gonna block that. Hmm. Oh, I don't have to be in there. What am I on about? I'm making it harder for myself. I don't have to be in there. There we go, that's fine. <laughs> Why did I put myself in there? That makes it so much harder. Oh, oh no, wait, I can I can literally just block that off and do that. <laughs> I was like, oh no, I can't see the end of this one. How am I gonna solve it? I'll just make my own end. That's all I have to do. There we go. Very nicely solved puzzles. This whole area too is a puzzle. Where are the outside bits here? What am I missing? Oh, there's a one there. Okay. There's a one here that I'm missing. like where I'd need to. Alright, I don't have an end. I have not made an end yet, so if I make an end here, no, I'll make an end there. So then I can go around here, I can get this one, and that's an end. Yeah, there we go! Haha! <laughs> And this one. Oh. Okay, this one is interesting. Because of these twos. Oh, I guess that kind of works. No, I... Mm. 
Still needs an end. Is, is, do I have another rock friend in here? Okay, I have these, but I don't think I can get them out of here. So, oh, yeah. Okay, rock friends. You need to not be in the way of the fours. So, will that do it? Yes, that will do it. Fabulous. I can't find any other friends to help me out with this nightmare. I need a friend for that one, I'm pretty sure. Ooh, okay. Thank you. I literally just... Oh no, there's the one. Oh, that one is annoying. Means I have to keep going back and forth like that. Oh, except I can't. Gotta go like that. Like that, there we go. This one. I feel like there's gotta be a way I can solve this. I wish I could get in there. Oh, wait, hold on. No, it still doesn't work because I... It would have to be three to get past there. Hmm. What a pain. I'll leave that one for now. I'll come back to that. Okay. Uh. Yep, thank you. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I've got many friends here. Okay, where, where, where are these going to need to go? This is going to be... Annoying, I think. Hmm. Thinking what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start by pushing these ones in. And then I'm gonna push one more in this side and then one more in the one in the other side. This one gonna go in this side. Like this. Oh, but I still need an end, so... Okay. Oh, I might be able to make this work. Right, what am I doing here? No, that, that one needs to be one further over. But to do that, like, I'm gonna pull it back if I move. So that's... Hmm. All right, I don't feel like I have another end doing it like this, though. That's the problem. Light mess of this. Also, Suzume, hello! Welcome, welcome, how's it going? Gay Wolfraid, happy Sapphic Sunday! Welcome, welcome, how's it going? How did the stream go? I hope you had a fun time. Thank you for sending the raid this way. Welcome on in! Uh, I am playing a cool little game, cool little puzzle game where I am this cool little rock. I'm a rock, I'm drawing lines. I'm having a great time. Everything is lines. It's good times. But I welcome. Oh, congrats on finishing the Talus Principle 2 DLC. Thank you so much. It was so much fun to do. I love that game so much. It was so great. <laughs> but I welcome on in, Raiders. To anyone who's new here, hello. I'm Liri. I'm a pink haired cat girl from the UK. And I love comfy games and puzzle games. And this is such a charming little puzzle game. I love this. Okay, yeah, I need... There we go. Will this do it? No, I need you, like, one further over as well. No! I'm borrowing you a second. You push that over, and then you can come out and be the end. Okay, I think this might do it. Oh, no, I need that one pushed further over as well.
Right, I just, I need to figure out where these have to be. Before I start faffing so much. Anyway, before I do all that, I'm just gonna do that. There we go! <laughs> oh, I just started Life After Magic! Oh, I saw that! I saw you were playing that! It looks so good. Looks like the kind of game I should check out. I, f I feel like I would relate to it. Not that I'm retired, of course. I'm still a very active magical girl doing many um, things like um, avoiding responsibility. Uh, <laughs> but it looks like a really cool game. Right, this one is, I feel like, oh yeah, like that. Like this, mwahaha. Wait, I can take the thingy off now, the the tetromino. I finished playing towers now, we can get rid of that for now. You can still drop them on my head. <laughs> yeah, outfit change too. Yeah, I also have a hairstyle change. This one's free. <laughs> oh, no, you just redeemed it. Okay. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, I also have the hair change too. Hairstyle. Although I feel like a lot of people, when they're like, oh, I have a transformation change, it's not like the same hairstyle, just styled a bit. <laughs> it's like, oh, I've got a hair change. I go from like short hair to really long hair. I'm like, I have a hair change. I kind of um, ruffle my hair up a bit. <laughs> but yeah, you can change the outfit. This is my, my magical girl design. I use it for... Um, uh, changing the world, um, saving the world, changing, saving the world. Okay, I think I need to send you down here. Push this right in there. How am I gonna make... No, I don't think this is gonna work. I don't have ends if I do it like this, that's the problem. There isn't an end I can reach. Unless I do that. But then I, I can't reach these ones in the middle if I do this. The problem, I need to reach all of these ones in the middle. And as soon as I pull them out, it becomes a problem. Oh my goodness. Oh, thank you for wasting your points too. Points into the abyss. You're officially broke now, don't worry, other people will feed the abyss for you. Thank you, Dima! <laughs> oh, thank you for the posture check too! Wait, yes, let me sit up straight. Have a big stretch. Oh, there we go. Yeah, this really is the perfect one to two hour game, isn't it? Because I looked up like the, the estimated playtime for it. And I was like, well, you know what? I always take so long when I'm playing games anyway. Because I'm just a chronic rambler. It's probably gonna be perfect. Right. Hmm. Yeah, it's like the main problem here is like I need a start and end point. Which I don't have at the moment. It's like, if I do this, I can go like, like that, and then I, I can't, I just can't reach these. So where do I need the rocks to be? Like, I need a rock here and here. And here and here? That feels really awkward to try and maneuver. So I need to pull that one over just one. I guess maybe I could use these to push them over. Get you back. Okay. Oh, maybe. 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 There it is. There it is. I got it. I got it. <laughs> yeah, this game is great. This game is great for making me think in really interesting ways. Oh, they're wands. Oh my goodness. How? How do I move these friends? 
in a way that works for this. Wait, let's just solve this one first. Hmm. I need to connect these. I need to move these all along. And then I go boop, boop. Okay, I've made a complete closed circuit here. So now I can do this. There. Got him. Got him. <laughs> Thank you for the head pets too. <laughs> oh, these ones here. How am I going to do this? Awful. Wait. No. No, I do I do need to actually hit them. I was going to be like, what if I just block everything? But I do, I do I do need to hit them. I I can't just block that and do that. I don't think no. It won't let me. Right, the problem is they're all like down at the bottom. How do I Okay. Well the first step is gonna be like this. Like that, and then it needs to go down. So I do that. So we start here, and then we go down. And then we go across, we go up. Then we go down here. Will this do it? Yes, there we go! I got it! <laughs> And now this one, yay. It's just like the same thing, but... Ah, oh, but I made a mess of it because... Because I need to reach the end, so I've got to do it like... There we go. Ha ha. And now it's just this. Great. What am I even doing with this? I thought I solved this one. Did it unsolve itself because I moved things? Did it unsolve because I moved these? Well, that's fine. I'll just move them back. I clicked, oh, did I click on it? Ah, it's okay. It's okay, I can simply do it again, like that. I can also do that. Haha. <laughs> there, solved. What else do I have? Let's go this way, oh, hello. Thank you very much, thank you very much. <laughs> 126 out of 132. Oh my goodness, are you kidding? That feels like an endgame puzzle. That feels like I need to get to 131 before I do that. So I've got to go find what I missed. This one. How the heck do I solve this one? They're like... Uh, I had like one friend over here I'd be able to solve it but I think all of my friends are trapped oh I didn't solve this either did I no I thought I solved this one no I guess I didn't hmm I feel like I need a friend here. 
Is this friends? Okay, these are not movable friends. So, not that one. Are there any friends over here I can steal? Hello? Hello? I, I won't be able to take them along these narrow passageways because of the way the push-pull system works. There has to be a friend around here somewhere I can borrow. Where are my friends? Where are my friends? I need you. My buddies. My pals. Where are they? Here's one! Oh, it's this one! It's the one from earlier! Oh my goodness. Wait, no, I, ca I can't bring you further up. I can't pull you. No! No, well, I have a shortcut back at least. Oh, I got so excited then. Right, is there anything else I've missed around here? There's a lot of space there. Right, where are these other five puzzles? It's so cruel when you see, like, a rock on a bridge and then it's like, yeah, you can't take that friend with you. It's okay. I missed. <laughs> the woobly sound does get a little bit much when you're walking around all the time, I will say that much. <laughs> I sound like a little UFO. I sound like a UFO flying through the air. Let's go this way. Did I miss stuff over here? Maybe. Miss stuff up here. Whoa. UFO on crinkly stilts. <laughs> That's what I am. Now there's gotta be a way I can solve this then. I just don't know where the end would be. Cause I need a way that I can position myself to make two ends. The only way I can think of doing that would be like in one of these corners, but these ones have the threes. Oh no, it would be the three ones. I can make that work. Why, why, why did I not think I could do that? I could just do that. There we go. Okay. 127. Here's another one. There's gotta be a way I can solve this then. I wish I could get in there. I just wanna climb inside. I don't know how to... How do I have a... Oh, wait. No. I thought I might have had an idea, but I don't think it's gonna work. So I was like, if I could go like up and then figure out a way around and then get them from the other corner, then maybe. I don't think I can do that. Hundred and twenty-eight, hundred and twenty-seven. What am I missing? See, I really feel like I could do with another rock here to make this work. <laughs> something like that and then have it end here but it isn't an end hmm. god i just wish i could be in the middle if i could just get in the middle <laughs> i want to be in there but i'm not You know what? I'm gonna go up and do the funky one. I'm gonna go up and try and do this one. This looks like 
a kind of end gamey type puzzle. But I really want to do it. Okay. Oh, how do I get the two here? Okay, no back. Oh, no, I don't want to draw this line! Like that. Oh, no, those ones are going to have to be hit with the two. It's going to be like that. Yes. This is what all of my training has led up to. I have now comprehended outer space. Hundred and twenty-eight. The music stopped. Okay, the music's back. <laughs> hmm. Alright, what else have I missed? Because there's like four puzzles left. I know where one of them is. Not sure where the other three are though, so that is going to be what I search for. I wonder if I can bring you anywhere. Oh wait! If I push this up here? No. I was going to say that I'll be able to like pull it from the other side, but as soon as I like back up, I pull it with me. So that doesn't quite work. Oh well. There was an area that ha had two friends where I'd be able to push both of them up, maybe? Maybe. <laughs> Dev thumbs up, yeah, just like, you you know how to stop people cheesing this one. Oh, hello! No, I see. I see thing. <gasps> yes. Take that space. Okay, and this is, this is also another end, but I don't know where they other part of it is. Haha! -ha. Oh, you're at 130! Nice! I love the thought of you playing along at the same time as me. And probably doing better than me. <laughs> this is this is just such a great game though. This is lovely. Yeah, that's the one where I was wondering if I could bring the friend out. I'm gonna try something actually. Okay, I think I need to make my way all the way around again. But that's okay, I'm just scuttling. I'll just scuttle along. All the way around. Go around here. <laughs> you don't have to talk at the same time, so I'm way better. But I, I feel like... Uh, Talking while I do puzzles is like a weird, a weird space because sometimes I don't remember to talk to people. Like I'll get so engrossed in a puzzle that I kind of forget I'm doing a puzzle. And then I realize I haven't said much in like two minutes and I'm like, um, uh, yeah, sorry. I just really love lasers. <laughs> uh, what else have I missed? Oh no, I already solved this one, and now I've, I clicked and unsolved it. I'm so smart! There we go. I'm so clever and intelligent. Alright, where are these- where are these other two I'm missing? And is there anything I can bring up this way? I'd really love to bring a friend around. That would be really good. It'd be very cool if I could do that. <laughs> also, Zarok, hello! Welcome, welcome. How's it going? Welcome to Big Brain Puzzle Time. I'm a little rock. I'm a little rock having a, a big, big time. Oh, here we go. Ha ha ha! 130. Two more. I know where one of them is. I don't know where the other one is. 
Is there any space I have missed? I feel like this could be space I've missed. Possibly. No, I don't think it is. Hmm. I've got two puzzles. Uh, no, I've already filled that in. Oh, that was, yeah, that was just like all this space. Any more space here? Um, what is goal? Uh, goal is draw a line, fill in the areas, but I've, I've already filled in most of this. But basically it's like, when you see a bit sticking out, that is a start. You cover all of the dots, and then you end at another point that's just like a closed end. That's it. Like, if there are dots, you have to go through that many sides. And that is the only concept to the game. And it's incredible. It's so well made. This game is so fun. It's so clever. I've been having so much fun drawing lines. Okay, here's here's one. I just need to find an end I can connect it to. Could be one up here, maybe? I can't see. I can't see an end for this chunk of space. Maybe like over this way? That is definitely a start end point, but I don't have another start end point to go with it. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, it is, it's one line per surface or colored space. Yeah, it started with just puzzles, and then I realized I could uh, go outside of the boxes. Oh yeah, it just it just canceled my my outer space solution never mind <laughs> and then I realized the floors were also puzzles and then I realized the walls were also puzzles oh now I have to do this again Boo. that's okay ba -ba -ba -ba. There we go. Okay. Okay, I fixed out of space again. <laughs> right, so it's just two puzzles. It's this one here, which I can't figure out. I can't figure out how to just get two of them. Unless I go like... like that oh hold on actually oh no i got it oh, i've got it i've got it i've got it oh yes i found it it's one i've got one puzzle left and i have no idea where it is but i am so proud of myself oh that was good that was good the hunt begins just i need to find just one space i have not filled in yet don't know where it is we shall see oh thank you thank you for the hydrate and the posture check Zarok let me have a big stretch a big stretch and a sip of my drink and I continue the hunt it'll be so funny if it turns out to be something that like I've, I've already done and I just undid it by accident. <laughs> I'm just gonna do that with all of the friends I find now. I'm gonna look for like the little friends. I'm gonna re... Redo that. No, okay, that's not it. Have 
about these ones. Pull them away from this puzzle before I do it. It's not you. It's not you. Yeah, because I filled that in with these friends, so that counts as filled. I'm pretty sure. Now I'm second guessing. <laughs> Gotta keep the space repairer healthy. Thank you. Although, like, I don't know if I am actually, like, repairing space. I may have just caused, like, space time problems. But it's probably fine. Alright, if I. Yeah, no, they, these aren't counting. It's here, I don't know what I'm missing. What have I missed? It'd be so funny if it's just something right at the very, very start of the game. Because I haven't really been like all the way back to the start. Let's do it, let's return to the start. Here's the start. It is. It is at the start. But it's a sneaky, sneaky one at the start. I did it! I found it! Every last one. Solve all puzzles. What a charming little puzzle game. What a great game. What an amazing game. I want more puzzles like this now. I love these kind of puzzles. These kind of puzzles are so fun. I love these. I love that. That was great. Oh, and that was like a, a, a perfect length to fill in the time after Tell Us 2 as well. That worked out so nicely. But, oh, what a great game, though. That was good. <laughs> Thank you for all of the confetti. <laughs> now we continue Tell Us 2 speedrun. What, I go back and break things? I could do that. But also, I love the little message that says, Congratulations, thank you for playing. You are so welcome. Thank you for making the game. That's so good. Oh, you notice there are some dark colored puzzles with gaps. Did I have to fill some puzzles with myself? Yes. Here's an example of one. If I click this, I can like... Okay, well, let me, like, unsolve it now. Oh, no, there we go. Like, if you look at this, it only has, like, one start point. So there's no way to solve this. Unless... Unless... I use myself as an endpoint. <laughs> so, yeah, the, the puzzle's like that. Like, those are the ones where it's like, oh yeah, you gotta use yourself to fill it in. It's so clever. It's so clever. Back to Power Box. I, I do still need to do all the bonus puzzles in Power Box. Uh, I ended up not playing them at the time because I finished, like, the main base game puzzles. And then I had other puzzle games that I really wanted to play as well because I, I I already have a huge backlog of games I want to play. I'm, I'll, I will be getting around to some of them soon. I'm excited. <laughs> But, yeah, at the time I was like, I'll leave the, the trickier ones for another time. And then I kind of forgot to do them. <laughs> but yeah, this was this was so nice. I'm so glad I played this. Uh, what's next? I'm thinking Mist. <laughs> I think Mist is going to be next. I still need to decide for sure. I also need to decide if I'm going to be streaming next Sunday or not. Because now that I've, like, finished Talos 2, like, the main reason why I kept streaming every Sunday was because I really like Talos 2. But I've been telling myself I need to take a break for several months now, and I've proceeded to not take a break. <laughs> so I think next week might be a no puzzle game week. But only for one week, and then I'll be back the week afterwards. And yeah, I think I'm, I'm gonna play Mist because it's something I've wanted to play for a while. It's been on the list of like, I will play this. I'm just not sure when. 
and I, I do remember playing it a really, really long time ago. I, I feel like I played it on the DS. Did it come out on the DS? I don't remember fully, but either way, I don't remember anything about it. It's been so long, so it's basically going to be a blind run. <laughs> but yeah, I'd love to play Mist and then also Riven afterwards as well, because I think it would be fun. But yeah, it's it's been a while, and I I I need to like have a little bit of time to to just like unwind entirely. Because at the moment, every time I've been like taking time off, I, I haven't actually been taking it off. I've been like, okay, I have a free day today. Let's record stuff. Let's do some stream stuff. Let's do some prep. And and it turns out to not be a break. <laughs> Which is, um, it's a very bad habit of mine. I, I need to learn how to stop. I'm really good at keeping going. I, I need to be better at learning how to stop, but it's okay. I'll get there. But yeah, I'm thinking next week, next Sunday will be a, a break. Oh, apparently it did come out on the DS. Oh yeah, I, cause like I vividly remember playing it on the DS, like at nighttime under my covers, lying in bed when I couldn't sleep. <laughs> but I don't remember much about it. So it's, I really want, I really wanted to play it for a while. So I'm excited to play that. But yeah, there's there are so many games on my list, and uh, Obduction is actually, I think it's a game that I either own or have on my wish list already. It's one that I've looked at that I want to play. So yeah, I have heard of that one too. It seems seems interesting. But yeah. Oh, anyway, let's let's close the game for now. Thank you. Hold on, let's check the credits. There we go. We need the credits for this too. <laughs> Yeah, shout out to Patrick Trainer. Thank you so much for the incredible puzzle games. All of the games that he's made have been so fun. Like, I had so much fun with Patrick's Power Box. That game was so clever. And also, uh, shout out to the playtesters, too. Because <laughs> I could not cheese those puzzles. It was good, well playtested. But yeah, that was, that was great. Also, the soundtrack, too. The soundtrack's so cool. It fits the game so well. But yeah, what a good game. Good game. I'm glad I played that. But for now, I shall... Bloop! <laughs> I'll head here, but I'm not going to end just yet. I want to have a little chat. I want to talk about puzzle games. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, the OST for this game is on Bandcamp for a dollar. I'm going to buy that. I'm going to buy that. I'm buying. I'm buying it. That that song is so relaxing and calming. It's so nice. Oh, you'd love to see me play Abduction. I, it's it's a game I do want to play. Um, I actually hold on, hold on. I'm gonna check something. If my stream starts lagging, it's because I'm opening the Epic Games launcher. <laughs> I'm really taking a risk, like doing this while I'm streaming. But I, I have a feeling. I may have picked it up as like a free game through Epic at some point. I don't know if it was that one or not. I did, I did, I have it, I have it. <laughs> I have abduction. <laughs> I have it through Epic. I got it as a free game on Epic a while ago. <laughs> so I actually do have it. It does mean I will have to like play it through epic games which is not my favorite thing i the the uh the epic games launcher i feel like it always eats up so many of my system resources whenever i have it open <laughs> but uh i i do want to check that out too it looks like a good game but yeah there are so many amazing puzzle games they're so good also ruby hello oh thank you for joining from the raid i'm glad you could make it you always forget you have games on Epic. Look, I'm I'm a terrible, terrible person who is like feeding into the Steam monopoly, but um, I have um, actively bought games through Steam in the past that I've already gotten for free through Epic, just so I don't have to load the launch. <laughs> it's just like, it's, it's bad. It's like, I just, I just find Steam so convenient. I just, I'm, I just, I just like, I like my massive library of Steam games. <laughs> Thank you. 
but yeah. Yeah, GOG is so good. GOG or itch are usually like my priorities for getting games if it's like not available on Steam at a decent price. But yeah, I I I only have an Epic account because um I started playing Fortnite with some friends, so I got it for that. And then I've just been picking up so many of the free games every week. I have games I am never going to play in my Epic Games library, but I own them, so <laughs> I just pick them up just for the sake of it. I'm like, I'm I'm never gonna play this random football game, but what if I can use it as a like a thing to show off with? <laughs> But yeah. And hello! Mihoi minoi moi! Welcome, welcome! I say welcome, I'm gonna be ending the stream soon, but... Ah, uh, this was really fun though. I I feel like that was like the perfect... The perfect time to play it too, because... Uh, Linelith is a very short game. I don't think it would have been enough for like a whole stream. But just playing it after finishing Talos 2... That, that worked out nicely. That worked out really nicely. Oh, wait, wait, the... Oh, the, the Talos Principle 2 soundtrack on Bandcamp doesn't include the Somnodrome song. Oh, oh, I've... I, I think I've, I've already bought the soundtrack from a couple of places. I've also bought the game a couple of times because I, I really love the Talos Principle and I, I want to support them. <laughs> Yeah, oh, yeah, claim the free games every week too. Oh, sad you missed Hades being free on Epic a few years ago. Oh, I'm trying to think. What are like the coolest games that I've gotten for free through Epic? I'm gonna have a look. I'm gonna have a look and see what I have in my library. How many games do I have? Is there a way I can see how many? I don't think there's a way I- Oh, no, I have 191 games in my Epic Games library. And I've never bought a single one. I've not bought a single thing through Epic. And I've got 191 things in my library. That's incredible. That's so funny. Oh, The Witness was free. Wait, was it? Oh, actually, I think that's how I discovered Filament. When I played Filament, that game was so fun. I discovered it because it was free on Epic the one time. I picked it up free on Epic and then I think it might have been Barb who mentioned it actually, thinking about it. But yeah, I just, I look through my Epic Games library and I'm like, am I ever going to play uh, Chivalry 2? I'm not. I'm never gonna play that. Am I ever gonna play Call of the Wild, The Angler? Okay, I, I, I might actually play that one. Never mind. <laughs> That's a fishing game. <laughs> what else do I have in here? There's like, there's so much. There's things like Super Meat Boy, which are like the complete opposite of the kind of game I enjoy. <laughs> and I still picked it up because I was like, yeah, it's free. Yeah, Celeste was free. Yeah, I think I got Celeste free through Epic. Oh, I think I also got Celeste in an itch bundle at one point. One of the charity bundles. Uh, what, what is... What are these? Yeah, most of these games just look like... They look like cool games. But also not the kind of game I would ever play. Like, I don't think I'm going to be playing The Evil Within. Or The Evil Within 2. I don't think I'm going to be playing Golden Light. I've seen playthroughs of that game. That is not my kind of game. What else have I got? I've got Ghostwire Tokyo. Uh, Solstice? That looks quite cool. I'm probably not going to play it. Farming Simulator 19. Okay, now we've got the real games. Hold on. Actually, I've, I've, ha I've got an idea. I wonder... This might be a terrible idea. Let me try something. I hope I don't like... Do something bad by doing this. I'm gonna try something. Please bear with me a second. How 
could I make this show up? I want to see if I can just share my Epic Games launcher window, but I don't think it's showing up. Oh yeah, it's, it's just not showing up. It's just a black box. I was like, I can just show you my library, but no, it's like, it's not actually showing anything. Why is it doing that? Um, hmm. Capture third party overlays? No, that just broke it. Oh no, okay. Um, slow capture method? Uh, yeah, this, it's not, it, it just doesn't want to show up. That's so strange. Yeah, it's, it's showing like, like the minimize and maximize and the close window thing, but it's not actually showing the thing. Like you can see when I'm mousing over a game because it changes to the hand, but it's not, it's not showing it. Oh, that's strange. Oh, well, I tried. I tried. I can still just read the games out at least. Thank you, Epic Games. This is why I don't use you. <laughs> right, what else have I got? Let's, uh, what if I sort by alphabetical? Okay, I have Alien Isolation. I have Bioshock. I have Bioshock 2. I have Bioshock Infinite. I have <laughs> Bloons Tower Defense 6. I've, I've actually played a, a, a more of that than I should probably admit. <laughs> Wait, I didn't realize I have Borderlands. <laughs> I have Borderlands through Epic. I've just played through all the games on Steam. Right, because every now and then I pick up a game on Epic that I think looks so cool and I want to play it. But I always forget that I own it because it's through Epic. What else do I have? Oh, Dishonored. Dying Light. Electrician Simulator. <laughs> Wait, what is Electrician Simulator? No, I don't want to install it. I just want to look at the game. Electrician Simulator. Okay, yeah, it's just... It's, it's like a, a first-person house flipper-esque kind of game, but you're an electrician. Okay. I was wondering if it might actually be like a puzzle game with like connecting wires and stuff, but it's it's literally Electrician Simulator. I see. Uh, have I ever tried the two-player co-op puzzle games like Operation Tango? I, I think I've played all of them. I think I may have played almost all of them that exist. <laughs> I've played through a lot of them because uh, I do streams with my brother every Friday and we've been doing that for the past three and a half years. So anytime there is like a co-op game, we are immediately on that. We're, <laughs> we're just like, hey, I found another game we can play. Oh my goodness, finally. So we've played a lot of puzzle games. We've played a lot of shooter games as well. Like, we played through all of Halo together, we played through Borderlands together. We're currently on the, the Larian hype train, we finished Baldur's Gate 3 and we're on to Divinity. <laughs> but uh, we've played Operation Tango, we've played a lot of Escape Simulator together. We've done the We Were Here games, which I love a lot. Uh, I also played uh, It Takes Two with my good friend Daifuku. Um, what else have I played? I'm trying to think of the other co-op games. Oh, I played um, uh, Rusty Lake, uh, The Past Within, which was so fun as well. I love the Rusty Lake series. And yeah, and I played Bokura with my, my good friend Kels, and that was, that was so fun. I'd like to go through that again, but from the opposite perspective as well. But yeah, I've played quite a few, and I, I really love the aspect of co-op games where you have to communicate, like the asymmetric ones where everyone sees something different. I love those kind of games. Like where you have to communicate, where it's like if you if you don't like work together, you can't figure it out. Those ones are my favorites. I love it. <laughs> but yeah, I've um I've got quite a few games on my list crossed off. And it's also funny because I actually found a little text document I made like at the start of the year, I think, either at the start of this year or the end of last year. 
and I've crossed off so many of the games on the list and I feel so proud. Cause like, I had it as a list of streams I wanna do and one of them was like, The Swapper, I played that. One of them was Outer Wilds, oh did I play that. Uh, Assemble with Care, I played that. Magnesium 173, I played that. The Case of the Golden Idol, I played that. It's so nice. So nice looking through it and being like, oh, I'm actually doing those things I wanted to. That's so cool. <laughs> I love it. I'll maybe play Bokura three times. Honestly, I'm, I'd be down for it. It's, I actually was talking to Kals about playing it again at some point, but then we both got so busy, we just didn't get to schedule it yet. But I'd like to revisit that. I'd like to revisit that from the, the opposite sides. Yeah. Oh, looking at all the games tagged co-op and puzzle in your library. Yeah, some of them are quite a stretch to call them co-op puzzle games. But yeah, there's so many times, like, I look for co-op games and it just gives multiplayer games that aren't actually co-op. It's like PvP. And that is not what we're looking for. <laughs> Outer Wilds mentioned. Yes! I am so excited for when I receive my Outer Wilds Collector's Edition. Because that's meant to be shipping, like, August-September time. And we are already in August now. So I'm extremely excited for that. As soon as that comes in, I'm going to be playing kazoo on stream constantly. <laughs> but I'm, I'm really excited for that. That was something that got funded through uh, stream goals and donations. So thank you so much, everyone, who gave generously for me to get an Outer Wilds kazoo. And also the rest of the stuff, too. I'm mostly hyped about the kazoo. I'm a very simply, simple to please girl. Ah, <laughs> uh, Unrailed, though a different type of co-op multiplayer, is very fun with friends. Oh, I've seen that game, but I think that's more the kind of game that would stress me out, I think. <laughs> I'm, I, I don't feel like I'm very good with anything that has like a time limit. Like, even if it's like a generous time limit, I feel like as soon as you stick a timer on the screen or like add like a time constraint, I start to panic. And it it's something that I did notice in Outer Wilds as well at some points, like with time limits and starting to get stressed because of like having to do things at the right time. But I managed to get through it in Outer Wilds because it felt like slightly different and there was never like an active, here is the time, you're about to run out of time, you've got 10 seconds left, you've got five seconds left. But yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just like, I prefer slow paced things. I prefer games where I can just take my time with it, where I don't have to worry about rushing because like I mostly play games to de-stress. I don't want anything that's gonna stress me out more <laughs> so like I, I play games to slow down a bit so it's it's why I play a lot of slower paced games or games where it's not even so much that they're slower paced but that you can just take them at whatever pace you like like Talos and Talos 2 those games all of the puzzles in them like you can take your time figuring them out you don't have to instantly have the solution you don't have to rush through you can like just watch like patrol routes of bombs in the first game and figure out where they're going to go and you never have to worry about like really like squeezing for time and i i like that a lot oh the most stressed you've been playing games lately was when you and your mates picked up chain together i have seen so many people playing that game i actually got asked if i wanted to play it too and i was like I'm sorry. I could not play that game. I think I would cry. <laughs> it is really funny sometimes, though. Like, hearing the despair in people's voices. That sounds, like, really sadistic of me. <laughs> but yeah, I, d I don't think I'd enjoy playing that. But it is very funny to watch people sometimes. Oh, but the speed run. Wait, you're right. Yeah, the only time I'm fine with time constraints is when I'm doing a, a very high-paced speed run of Talos. And succeeding immediately very fast. Yeah, Talos 1 did have the top of the tower puzzle, but it was pretty generous with the timer. Yeah, it's like... Even if there is like a bit of a time constraint, 
so long as it's not like a full pressure, 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 stress, stress, stress kind of situation, I can kind of deal with it. Oh, you'd only play the checkpoint version. I, I don't think I'd even be able to do that. It's like, for a start, I'm notoriously bad at platforming. <laughs> I would be so bad at anything. Like, I'm bad at platforming on my own. Having other people attached to me that I could drag down with me, that just sounds like my biggest nightmare. I would feel so worried about ruining everyone else's runs. <laughs> I'd just be worried the whole time. But ah, uh, so much fun, but you don't do well with heights in games anyway. Ah, uh, so th all those things like only up, the chain together, all the like the very climb to the top type ones, I'm guessing aren't the best for you. I, I don't tend to have a problem with heights. I'll be the type to just jump off a cliff just to see what will happen. <laughs> But yeah, I'm, I'm no good at, like, the stressful games. I like to have a, a comfy time. Although it's like, I say that, it, it depends on the stress. Like, emotional, psychological stress. <laughs> I can deal with that. I enjoy that sometimes. But when it's to do with rushing in time, it's different. But yeah, double GG today. Wait, yeah, I completed two games today. <laughs> Never mind the fact that one of them's been an ongoing thing for like a hundred hours. I, I completed two games today. I'm proud of myself. But also, it's uh, past 1am now. So I should probably see about trying to get some rest. This has been so much fun though. I'm so glad. I'm so glad I just decided to play Lineless. I'm so glad I got to finish Talos 2. I'm so glad I went back to uncheese those puzzles. <laughs> I feel accomplished. I feel like I've I've done a good job. But yes, let's uh let's find someone to send a raid on to before I head off to bed. Let's see who is live. Who we got? I just tabbed back into my internet browser and it's just full of screenshots of where the, <laughs> where the the, the, the sparks are. <laughs> just loads of tabs of like the the Prometheus flames. I got them now. We got them. Wait, hold on. Is is Momoka still alive? She's still going. Yeah, she's still going. Okay, Momo. Ushime Momoka, lovely friend of mine, member of Verpro. We go quick. We go quick. I don't know how much longer she's gonna stream for. She's doing an unarchived, unarchived karaoke stream, and I wanna, I wanna hear her. I wanna hear her karaoke. I hope she doesn't end soon. I hope she does at least one more song. I hope. <laughs> but uh, this has been so much fun. I've had so much fun today. I'll be back next week with a probably more limited schedule. I'm going to try and actually take a break next week. Please wish me luck in not actually doing stuff. But yes, that is it from now. Let me have a hydrate before we go. And I shall get ready for bed. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining me today. And until next time, bye-bye.